Illuminated by firelight, a spiritual dance begins. Within the blaze burns a courage tempered by battle. In this conflagration, bonds between warriors are forged. They crystallize together into the pillars of today. Pillars with the strength to slay demons. Even so, the fires of conflict rage on. Demons against humans. Within the blaze, burns a courage tempered by battle. Within the blaze, burns a young man's determination. Too slow! <laughs> Sabito's movements are so calculated. If I don't focus, he'll just keep deflecting. Tanjiro Kamado. You were once so pitiful, but look at you now. You finally learned proper breathing techniques. You've swung your sword thousands of times even as your arms were screaming in pain. No matter how many times I knocked you down, you got back up and challenged me again. That shows true strength. The fact that I am facing you with a real sword this time proves it! We finish this tonight. Summon every ounce of determination you can muster. I won't be holding back, and neither should you. Now come! Let's go! You're mine! Oh? <coughs> you were able to handle that? Not bad. I need to use the skills or Okodaki taught me to take down Sabito! Come on, Tanjiro! You can do this! Wonderful <coughs> face it! So you can fight. <coughs> you have good control. There. That's it. I to summon everything I'm capable of! I can't hold anything back! I will not yield! This will end it! Splendid. This will end it! This will end it! Water breathing! Ten four! Constant flux! You've grown strong. There you go. I'm coming up for you! There! Too slow! You lack resolve. Remember what Uro Kodaki taught you! Move your legs. Don't stop now! If you call yourself a man, then do it! Unless you plan to lie down and die! There's nowhere else to go but forward! Now get up! Grab your sword and face me again! If you can cut this boulder in two, I'll allow you to enter final selection. <clears throat> the boulder... To cut it, I need to defeat Sabito. But no matter how many times we fight, Where did I go wrong? How did...
did things turn out this way? I was just living my life day by day. Doing honest work with my family. We were poor. But we had a nice meal in town once in a while. We... were so happy. Whenever happiness is destroyed, you'll find the smell of blood in the air. That awful day. The one night I didn't come home. Mom, my siblings, they all died. They were attacked by a demon, and that was it. It must have been painful. You suffered, didn't you? I'm sorry. I couldn't save you. I... I'm sorry. But you're suffering too, aren't you, Tanjiro? Get up. You don't need to suffer alone. I'm here too. Together, you and I can overcome this sadness. Don't you think? That's right. I can't forget that we still have each other. Nezuko. That night, your humanity was torn away from you. But you still managed to hold on to one important thing. Your own life. Sabito's right. Go forward. There's nowhere else to go! I'll find a way to make Nezuko human again! I'll avenge my whole family! I made my decision when I picked up the sword! Now! Tanjiro! Finally. You've grown into a real man. If I gave up now, Nezuko would never go back to normal. Besides, Orokodaki has done so much for me. And I can't waste Makomo's training! Today's the day. I will defeat you! Let's go! Show me what you can do! Let's try to... Try me. Blood flowing through your body. Soon, you'll know how strong you've truly become. Will you fall to the ground once again? Or will you finally come out on top? Show me! Don't leave yourself open! If I were a demon, I'd have killed you already! Sabato's right. When things get tough, I have to stay calm. It's time to finish this, Tanjiro! He's doing it. In that case... Total concentration! Water breathing! Fourth form! Striking time! A tie? Wait. No. Tanjiro is... There! The opening thread! Faster!
keep winning, Tanjiro. You must defeat him. <gasps> the boulder. Where are Sabito and Makomo? Hmm. <laughs> I didn't think you would actually do it. Hmm. <laughs> to be honest, I never had any intention of sending you to final selection. I couldn't bear to see any more children die. I was sure you wouldn't be able to cut through this boulder, but... Well done, my boy. Truly remarkable. I am proud, you know. Make sure you come back alive from final selection. Your sister and I will be waiting for you. Within the blaze burns a young man's determination. And with this in his heart, he walks the path of a demon slayer. Done. Hmm, looks good. Thanks. Dinner's... Oh, thank you. I I'm sorry, I could have made the food. It's nothing. It's the least I could do. <sighs> thank you for the meal. The time has come. Right. Final selection is at Mount Fujikasan. I've been there a few times, but it's a very strange place. How so? It is something you'll have to see for yourself. I'm sure it'll surprise you, too. I see. What's this? It is called a warding mask. It is enchanted with a protection spell to keep you from harm. Take it with you. Got it. Thank you. This is all that I can do for you now. The rest is up to you, Tanjiro. Make sure you are well rested. I still don't know why Tomioka didn't slay Nezuko, or why he told me about Hirokodaki. But it's thanks to him that we're here now. 
If I join the Demon Slayer Corps, I'm bound to learn more about demons. Either way, it seems like my best shot at figuring out how to turn Nezuko back into a human. But to do that, first I have to pass final selection. Nezuko. She's been sleeping since we got to Uro Kodaki's place. The doctor didn't find anything wrong with her, but it's not normal for her to be asleep this long. I'm worried she'll just never wake up. You're gonna be okay. Right, Nezuko? I'm going to go out for a bit, but I'll be back soon, alright? Be a good girl now. Don't worry about your sister. I'll take good care of her for you. Thanks. You have a keen nose like me, Tanjiro. Perhaps it will be the key to your survival during final selection. My nose? You must sharpen your sense of smell and sniff out the dangers around you. I know you can do it. Just be sure to come back alive. Right. Guess I'm off. See you later. What's this? Huh? Say hi to Sabito and Makomo! Tanjiro? That's impossible! How do you know the names of the dead? So this is Mount Fujikasane. Wisteria? It's all over the place. I thought it was out of season. So many people. Good evening. Good evening. Tonight you've come to enter the Demon Slayer Corps' final selection. Thank you all for being here. Here on Mount Fujikasane, there are several demons that have been captured by Demon Slayer swordsmen. They're kept here for this event. The Wisteria Blossoms prevent them from escaping. They bloom on this mountain year-round, covering everything from the base 
to halfway up the top. But the wisteria ends here. Demons abound from this point on. And they're very hungry. In order to complete final selection, you must survive for seven days beyond the wisteria's protection. Now, your trial begins. Okay, there are demons waiting from this point on. There are demons lurking here. Don't be afraid. Just keep moving forward. The entrance of the mountain was covered in wisteria. It was beautiful and completely different from here. What a strange place. Okay. Excuse me. <clears throat> there are scents coming from all directions now. Fear, adrenaline, and demons. <clears throat> Haven't tasted human flesh in forever! Two already. Will I be able to take them on? Here goes! <laughs> I can't go away! That was nothing! Stay focused. Come on! My mouth's watery! <laughs> <laughs> Let's try that again! No way! That was nothing! Faster, faster than I thought! I can see the demon's movements! And if I can see their movements, I can take them down no problem! Another one! Stay focused! <laughs> Let's try that again. Come at me. Stay focused. What the hell's up with this guy? He's super strong! Now I can fight back! Here we go. I just have to cut off their head! That was nothing! Come at me! Stay focused! <laughs> I did it. I killed demons. I'm getting stronger. I can feel it. So my training wasn't for nothing. I did master it. Rest in peace.
All right, time to move on. Excuse me. I can't go any further. I'll have to find a different way. What the... what's that awful smell? Excuse me, what? Uh -huh. huh? Is that? their movements. All I have to do is remember my training. Are you okay? What? what the hell was that? Was it a demon? He doesn't look too badly hurt. Some weirdo came out of nowhere and attacked me. He was shouting about something, but I couldn't tell what. He's right. There's a strange smell in the air. It isn't a demon. It smells similar to a human. But also like in... What? That man with the strange scent is somewhere on this mountain. Gotta stay alert. I smell blood. Come at me! 
Butterfall face it! Come at me! Stay focused. That was nothing! Come at me! Stare! What are we doing? face it! You can do this, Tanjiro! No way! Let's try that again! Smell it! The opening threat! Another participant? He seems awfully nervous about something. was just the wind. There are so many kinds of people here. Okay. This tree was knocked over. I can use this. scent is growing stronger. I smell blood. Hmm. 
And there's something nearby. I wonder if it's a participant. He's another one of the participants in Final Selection. Excuse me! Get the hell out of my face! Oh, okay. Okay. What's this? can smell blood up ahead. I wonder what happened. <coughs> wow, that was amazing. Thank you. You saved me. What's your name? What? What? What a strange girl. Okay. My heart's beating faster. The pressure around here must be getting heavier. Don't lose focus. Concentrate. Come on, get a grip, Tanjiro! What the? I can smell blood up ahead. I wonder what happened. <sighs> Are these handprints? So big. All the trees around here have been knocked over, too. Huh? Uh, 
This smell's getting stronger. I must be getting close. It's one of my sweet little fox cubs. It's your mom, yes. Say, fox cub, what year of the Meiji era is it? Huh? It's the Taisho period. Taisho? <gasps> ah! Already? We have passed into a new period! And still, I'm stuck inside this Wisteria prison! Ah! Unforgivable! Unforgivable! Damn you, Urukodaki! Damn you, damn you, damn you! You know Urukodaki? Of course I do! Urukodaki's the one who captured and brought me here! <laughs> I promised myself I'd kill every single one of them. You know, the ones who stood out to me the most were those two. The boy's hair was an unusual shade of pink, a scar by his mouth. He was the most powerful of the lot. The other was a girl who wore a flowery kimono. Small, not much power, but awfully agile. Could it be? Those two were killed by this demon? But how? I trained with them. Your mask. That's what gives you away as one of Uro Kodaki's brats. Easy to spot the texture of one of the masks he's got. He calls them warning masks, right? Except that's how I pick out who to eat. They're all inside my belly. It's as if he guided them to their death. With the one that killed Sabito and Makomo! If you're going to blame someone, blame Buro Kodaki. He's the one who trapped me in here. No, what you've done is unforgivable! Yeah, 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 yeah. Stay focused, amateur. Yeah! Let's try the. Come at me. For real. Stay focused. Hold it. This isn't just for Sabito and Makomo. I'm going to avenge every life that you've taken. <laughs> I fought many who said the same, but none have yet to survive. You're just going to be one more in my belly. Waterfall face it! Oh. There! Not good enough.
Sabito! Makomo! You two have helped me become stronger! You give me the strength I need to survive! And that's why I won't lose! Not to this demon! Let's try- I'm coming soon! <laughs> Slayer's the last thing I'm ever going to see! What a sad scent. Back to Uro Kodaki.
Only four of us? We started with over 20. I'm gonna die. I'm done for. I've survived for now, but soon enough, dead. Welcome back, everyone. And congratulations. We are pleased to see you're safe. So? I made it back alive. What do I do now? Where's my sword? Patience. We must first issue you all uniforms. We will first take your measurements, and then you will be imprinted with your rank. There are ten ranks in all. From Kinoe to Mizunoto. You all start at Mizunoto. This is the lowest rank in the Demon Slayer Corps. And our swords? In a moment, you will be given the chance to select the ore that will be used to forge your swords. Your weapons will be ready for you 10 to 15 days later. But for... Now that you're Demon Slayers, you must each be assigned your own Kasugai Crow. The Kasugai Crows are primarily used to facilitate communication. Wait, crows? Isn't this a sparrow? Who the hell cares about some stupid crow? I want my sword right now. Give it to me before I get angry. The color changing katana. I want it now, do you hear me? Stop that. Take... Huh? Who the hell are you? Give it your best shot. Yeah! <laughs> You little... Are you finished chatting with each other? Now, the time has come. Please select an ore to use for your sword. <sighs> the steel you will use to protect yourself, and to annihilate countless demons, will be that of your own choosing. I'm gonna be dead soon anyway. Probably. They want us to choose, but how are we supposed to know which one to pick? I don't have a damn clue. Really? Five of them were able to survive. That's excellent. The number of my children continues to grow. What kinds of swordsmen will they be? Just when I thought I could finally go back, my body is aching. The fatigue is hitting me all at once. Nezuko. Rokodaki. Nezuko. It's you.
้าวไฮเดอร์ไม่ชื่อคุณฉันเป็นไฮเดอร์ไม่เป็นไรฉันเป็นฮาร์ฟูดชิโรคาเมโดมาเข้าฉันเป็นไฮเดอร์ฉันเป็นไฮเดอร์ไม่เป็นไรฉันเป็นไฮเดอร์ฉันเป็นมาจากสายน้ำเงินไอรอนแซนและสายน้ำเงินเหล่านี้เฮ้ยคุณเป็นผู้ดีคุณเป็นผู้ใหญ่เขาผลิตสีแดงที่สามารถรับแสงอาทิตย์ได้ว้าวจริงๆขอเข้ามาคุณเห็นมูนต์โยโกะถูกผลิตในแสงอาทิตย์ทุกวันไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ในดินไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสงอาทิตย์ไม่มีแสง Did he even hear me? The man still refuses to listen to a word anyone else says. Mm. Hey, you're a child of brightness, aren't you? Uh, my parents' names were Tanjiro and Kie. That's not what I mean. You know how your hair and eyes have a reddish hue to them. When a family that works with fire has a child like you, it's considered lucky, a cause for celebration. Is it really? I had no idea. That means there's a good chance this sword will turn red. Right, Duro Kodaki? Yes. Come on, draw it already. Nichirin swords are also referred to as color-changing katanas. Their color shifts depending on the bearer. Black. That's interesting. Why? Does it mean something bad? Is it? No, no. It's just something you don't see very often. It's pitch black. I was really hoping I'd get to see a sword turn bright red. <laughs> Ouch! Hey, let go! Stop, please! Ow! How old are you anyway? <laughs> Damn it! Why? In that town to the northwest, young girls are disappearing. Night after night, at least one of them vanishes. This is the Demon Slayer uniform I was provided. It's a perfect fit. Okay then. That uniform is made with a special kind of fiber. It's lightweight, water-resistant, non-flammable. A low-level demon's fangs and talons are incapable of penetrating that fabric. What's that? You plan on traveling with Nezuko, correct? But demons perish when exposed to sunlight. That's why I'm gifting you this box to carry her during the day. 
It's built from a very light wood called cloudy cedar. It's been coated in rock lacquer to reinforce the exterior and make it more durable, enough to withstand some abuse. Oh. Thanks, Orokodaki. By the way, Tanjiro. Yes? Since you're starting out as a demon slayer, there are some things I would like to explain. You should know, there are different kinds of demons. Some demons use a special spell called a blood demon art to give them abilities. You may end up having to face some of them in the near future as well. And fighting against supernatural abilities will be more difficult than anything you've done. However, if you defeat demons and locate their source, you could find the one who turned Nezuko into a demon one day. <sighs> There's only one demon in the entire world that has the kind of blood that can turn a human. Just one. That's it. The first demon there ever was. He's been here for more than a thousand years. He's your target, the one who attacked your family. More importantly, I believe he's also the only one who might know how to turn your sister back into a human. <laughs> that demon's name is... Muzan Kibutsuji. Muzan Kibutsuji. Since he's the only one who can turn humans into demons, that means... He turned Nezuko. Once someone becomes a demon, they'll attack others indiscriminately, even their own family. They can't resist the urge to satiate their hunger with common sense alone. That's what it means to be a demon. At least, that was what I thought. Until I met Nezuko. There's no question that Nezuko is a demon, but in spite of that, she's never devoured a human. Nezuko was lying on top of our brother like a shield, protecting him. She hasn't eaten anyone. I've encountered many demons in my lifetime, but never once have I heard of anything like that. The question is, how does she maintain this state? This is only a guess. But I believe Nezuko can recover her strength by sleeping, instead of consuming human flesh as other demons do. Sleeping to recover her strength. Again, this is only a guess. I could be wrong. Since you were the only one at her side, you must continue to observe her. Understand? And one more thing. I don't know if this will be of any comfort or not. But while Nezuko was asleep, I used hypnotic suggestion on her. All humans are your family. Protect your family. The demons are your enemies. If a demon harms a human, never forgive them. That's what I told her. Tanjiro, I understand that you want to protect your sister, but you must keep in mind. Nezuko is a demon now. She's not a delicate flower who needs your protection. Regardless, this will be your first real mission, where you'll face a demon alone. I hope you both return safe and sound, though I'm sure you'll be fine. Yes, sir. Well, here we are. Nothing seems out of the ordinary, but I am picking up a peculiar scent. It's faint, but unpleasant. Let's take a look around. Hmm. I don't smell anything bad around here. Huh? Is that... Ew. 
Excuse me. Uh huh. Okay. Excuse me. Ah. Say thanks. Excuse me. <sighs> Many thanks. What the? Oh. Hmm. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me? Oh, come on! Excuse me. <sighs> oh, come on! Hey, listen! Hey. There's Kazumi. Poor thing. He doesn't look good. Well, he was right next to Sadako when she was taken. Taken? That person was one of the victims. Mr. Kazumi! I want to hear what happened last night. From you. This is where Satoko vanished. But I'm sure you don't believe me. I do believe you. I'm here to help. Now let's see. There's still a faint scent of the demon here. But it's uneven. Something's off. Who is this kid anyway? There's definitely a demon lurking in this town. But I need to find out more. Not much time left until sunset. I need to gather more information and track them down before night falls. Excuse me. Right. Hmm.
Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I can get down if I use that. I can just barely make it through. Huh? Is that... Excuse me. Yep. Excuse me. Pardon me. Maybe I should get to higher ground. Okay.
Excuse well Excuse me. Yeah. I think I can climb this. Okay. Excuse me. <sighs> what the? Right. Hmm. Oh no, it's nighttime already. I can smell the demon scent, but only slightly. The smells are all blending together. It's awful. This has to be the kidnapper. I should sort out the information I have so far. Focus. I just need to follow this scent. Excuse me. Keep a level head, but hurry! I need to get up there to follow the scent. Excuse me! What'd you say? <sighs> Whoa! I think I can get down there. Excuse me. Hmm? Uh. Hmm. <sighs> okay.
Excuse me. Focus. Don't lose the scent. Excuse me. What? Uh. Hey there. I need to get up there to follow the scent. I should be able to get up there using this. I can get down if I use that. Excuse me. Hmm? Uh. Why, certainly. I think I can get down there. Demon is just up ahead. I'm ready. Let's end this. There's no mistaking this smell. This is it. They're right here. See them. Although the scent is
I'm not satisfied at all, other me! I want to devour all of them! I need your help. Hold her for me and stay close. Uh, huh? Uh, all right. You monster! Bring Satoko back! The girl you took the other night! Satoko? Which one was that? If her hairpin is in this collection, then I'm afraid I've already eaten her. Sorry. That's... Satoko's... You... You killed... How cruel! That woman is mine! And her over! Nesuko, don't strain yourself! If it gets too dangerous, retreat! As if a mere human could defeat us! I'll tear you brats to shreds! I've never seen other humans fight the way he does. Don't be intimidated, other me! <laughs> Who would be intimidated by a mere human? I'll take pleasure in killing him. Ah! Attacks are more coordinated than expected. I can't let them be one step ahead of me. I have to predict their next move and react. You smell horrible. You give off a scent like rotten oil. I know where it comes from. Tell me, how many people have you killed? How many people have you eaten? Give me a break already! If women live too long, they turn ugly, and then they won't taste good anymore! I killed them for their own good, you know! You should be thanking us! <sighs> Never mind. <laughs> You can do it! I'll use my special move! You're mine! Just face it! against these three. All thanks to Nezuko's help. All right, let's end this here! Where did the other two go? Underneath? It's dragging me under! <laughs> Nezuko! I'm going in! Keep them safe for me! <laughs> Keep them safe! She can damn well try! But that woman is mine! I'll devour her whole! You damn traitor! Why are you teaming up with a human? 
Humans are weak and pathetic! Nothing more than prey! You're impossible to understand! I won't lose She can't use any special abilities! There's no way I'll be beaten by a weakling! Get out of my sight! Hurry! I've died already! Damn it all! Hurry! Die! This girl's powerful! Get out of my sight! Although she hasn't picked up any skills, she's still so strong! He must have given a massive amount of blood! Hurry! And die, damn it all! Hurry! And die! Hey! <laughs> How can she be this powerful without using a blood demon art? It's absurd! What do you know about Muzan Kibutsuji? Tell me! <laughs> I, I can't tell you. I just can't. You mustn't tell a soul. No one can know anything about me, understand? Don't forget, I'm always watching you. So if you tell anyone, I will know about it. I can! I can't! I can't! I can't! I can't! I can't tell you alright! <laughs>
I failed to get any information. Nazuko! She's fast asleep. Probably to heal her wounds. I failed. I'm sorry. But just hang on. I promise you this. I will make you human again! Mr. Kazumi? Are you alright? I lost my fiancé. How could I be alright? Mr. Kazumi, you have to go on. No matter what. In spite of losing people. Even though it's devastating. How am I supposed to do that? You're just a kid. What do you know? the hands of a boy. I swear! Yes. It may be hard on him to go so soon after his previous mission. But there are rumors of a demon in the area. I'd like him to investigate. There's also this faint feeling I have in my chest. I'd like him to find out what it is. Ah! I'm counting on you. I hope Mr. Kazumi can get back on his feet after what happened. I hope all those families can. I'm still not any closer to turning Nezuko back into a human. Uh -huh. You must head to Asakusa, Tokyo now! Rumor has it! A demon's lurking there! Grah! I've got another mission already? Yes, you do! Now... Would you at least give me a minute? No time! Move it! Oh, man... So this is a Sakusa.
Whoa. The night is as bright as the day here. It's totally different from living in the mountains. Huh? Listen up. Jeez. I see. I don't smell anything that stands out. Huh? Ah! Uh -huh. huh? What? Oh, goodness. Incredible and overwhelming. This is making me dizzy. Um, let's go over there, Nesuko. <sighs> I've never been to a place like this before. It's way too crowded. <sighs> that scent. Why is it here? And why now? I remember. It's the same scent that was left in my home. Moves on. Kibutsuchi! He's here, just up ahead. I won't let him get away. Not a chance! <sighs> no good. I can't go this way. I have to find another way through. Quick! Here, he's so close. Okay. Calm down. Calm down. <clears throat> this way, it's coming from over here. Okay. I'm still picking up the scent. I can do, do this. I won't let him get away. That vile scent. It's getting stronger. He's close. Hurry. 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 On keep boots, Uchi. <laughs> Daddy, who's that? He's. What is this? Is he? He's living here, posing as a human. I'm sorry. Is there something I can do for you? Do you need help? You seem a bit flustered. Darling, what's the matter? <laughs> You're human. 
girl and the woman, their scent is human. But how? Can't you tell? This guy is a demon. He eats people. Who is this boy? I really don't know. I'm just as confused as you are. I've never seen him before. He must have made a mistake. Thought that I was someone else. Oh, you think that's it? What's going on? Are you all right, sweetheart? No, stop! Stop it! Sweetheart! Listen, you need to worry about yourself, ma'am. It's all right. It'll all turn out fine. A woman's wound doesn't look fatal. This man hasn't killed anyone yet. Damn. Damn it all! I can't leave this man alone here! Muzan Kibutsuji! No matter where you go! I promise you won't escape me! What's the matter with that boy, Tsukihiko? Tsukihiko? I'll follow you to the ends of hell! And my blade will be the last thing you see! I'll never forgive you! For what you've done! Those Hanafuda earrings. What the hell's going on over here? Another drunk. Step away from that man right- I can't. Bring restraints to hold him down. Quickly! Get away from him! Get up! Please don't do that. I'm the only one who can hold him back. I said get off! Let me go! I don't want this person to kill anybody! Just stay out of the way. Someone could get hurt! But, um, my sister's waiting for me to come get her, actually. I see. I'll go ahead and take these two in for treatment, then. Yushiro, please show him the way when he is ready. Me? But I don't want to be separated from you. Yushiro, do as I say. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Well then, I shall see you again soon. Nezuko. Nezuko! Hmm? I'm so sorry, Nezuko. I left you behind. Hmm? Huh? Oh. Yushiro's safe. He'll guide us from here. The place we're going is hidden by a concealment spell. If you weren't with me, you'd never find it. Under concealment? Oh yeah, before we go... Did you know that girl is a demon? And not much to look at, either. What was that? Did he just... Doesn't that mean ugly? But who? Nezuko? You gotta be out of your mind! Who would look at Nezuko and think she's ugly? She was the most beautiful girl in our hometown, you know that? Let's go. I know, we're already coming! But take back what you said about her!
Hey, you. Oh. What the? Huh? That's odd. The scent suddenly stops here. What could this mean? D do I just keep going? You're slow. Hey, what's going- I already explained this to you, didn't I? This is my concealment spell. I can hide buildings, humans, and even smells. It's what I use to hide Lady Tamayo's clinic. That's why you won't find it unless you're with me. All right, but you need to go a little slower or else I... Let's get on with it. We will not have Lady Tamayo waiting on us. And... If I don't get closer, I'm gonna lose his scent. Why can't he just wait for us? Oh, jeez. How is he so fast? I feel so frustrated. Wait, I know. It's because he called Nezuko ugly. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yujiro just doesn't get it. Nezuko isn't ugly. Stay focused. Don't lose the scent. I have 
have to catch up to Yushiro so we can take a look at Nezuko again! There's an entire house hidden back here? Hurry up! You better make sure you don't offend the lady in any way. Got it? Come in. I've returned, my lady. I'm sorry that I left everything for you to take care of. So how's she doing? She'll make a full recovery. But her husband had to be locked up. He's restrained in the basement. Isn't it difficult treating humans? With all that blood, I mean. Is that what you think? She chokes back her own drool when she treats a human? Cause demons can't control themselves? Don't do that. Treating humans is not all that difficult, actually. At least, for me. But it is different for other demons. I have modified my body's physiology quite considerably. And I've removed Kibutsuji's curse. What curse? And what kind of changes? Why don't we go somewhere we can sit down and talk? I need to hear your side of the story as well. I see. Now I understand what happened. In that case, I think I can certainly be of help to you. But first, I would like to continue where I left off, and tell you a- As I said earlier, we are demons. However, I made several adjustments to our bodies so we could continue to live without harming any human beings. As a result, we can survive on just a small amount of human blood. Wait, blood? So you're saying- I understand if you find it distasteful but I buy it from those in poverty. I tell them I'll use it for transfusions. But of course, I never take enough blood to impair anyone. No wonder. That would explain why neither one of them has the same scent as a normal demon. And Yushiro needs even less blood than I do, since I'm the one who turned him into a demon. You turned him? But how? How did I do it? Well, as far as anyone knows, Kibutsuji is the only one who can create demons. And that is more or less accurate. I tried for over 200 years, and still Yushiro was my only successful transformation. What? I'm sorry, I should clarify. Creating more demons is not one of my goals. I only attempt to do so when necessary, on the terminally ill or injured, and only when they won't otherwise survive. And even in those cases, I always ask in advance if they would truly prefer to live on as a demon. <laughs> her scent is pure. No signs of deception. I think I can trust her. Miss Tamayo, once someone becomes a demon, is there a way to turn them back again? A way to make a demon human again? There is. <laughs> Please, tell me how! There's always some form of medicine or aid, no matter the wound or ailment. That said, I don't yet know how to turn a demon back into a human, but I promise we will find a way. We are quite dedicated to establishing such a treatment. The first step involves studying the blood of a number of different demons, which means I have two favors to ask you. First, I'd like permission to study your sister's blood. Second, we need more samples. I'd like you to retrieve them from demons that have Kibutsuji's blood running strong through their veins. Nezuko's condition is extremely rare, perhaps entirely unique. I understand she was asleep for two years. I believe her body changed during that time. In most cases, that long without food, neither human flesh nor the blood of an animal, would undoubtedly cause any demon to grow violent. However, against all odds, Nezuko is showing none of those signs. That miracle could be the key to finding a solution. Nezuko... But my second request is not a simple one. 
When I say demons with Kibutsuji's blood, I mean demons with powers like those of Kibutsuji himself. Extracting blood from that kind of demon won't be easy. So, what do you think? Are these requests acceptable? If not pleasant. If it's really the only way, then I'll do it. Besides, if you study all that blood, and you can create this medicine, then it won't just be Nezuka, will it? A whole lot of other people will be saved too. Yes, they will. <sighs> oh no. Get down! Turns out you... Stupid demon slayer! Look what's on your forehead! Oh, there's a talisman! How did that get there? I will lend you my vision through that talisman! With my vision, you'll be able to see the arrow's movements! So hurry up and cut their heads off! Wow, I had no idea he could do this! Thank you! Earrings, earrings! I did you tell I'll be the favorite for sure. Indeed. Let's get this over with. Thanks to Yushiro, I can see the balls. Let's finish this. Follow my lead, Yahaba. Now to finish this! No! That was nothing! <laughs> Hey, Susamaru, can't you use your head a bit more? Water breathing! Transform! Constant flux! My kimono is covered with dust. Stop whining. Your kimono looks just fine to me. How'd you get to be so uptight anyway? Watch your back! Don't let your guard down! If they really are part of the 12 Kizuki, don't underestimate them! They're more powerful than any other demon you've faced before! Right! Keep my guard up and watch my back! Just be careful. And breathe. Let's finish this. Follow my lead, Yahaba. You and tough one to crack. Stop. I have to keep moving. I need to go faster. Lady Tomayo, let's escape while they're all distracted. Uh -huh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm coming after you. <laughs> there. No. 
Come at me! Stay I'll throw as hard as I can! Weak. So weak. Humans are weak. Frail. Come down, touch me. Come down and see through the enemy's attacks. Let's have some fun. Hold it. This will end it. Stay focused. I'll throw as hard as I can. Let's have some fun. Hold it. Cat. Wonderful things. Not bad for an amateur. <laughs> now we're talking! Oh? Can you believe our luck? We've found Tamiyo the fugitive. She'll make quite a souvenir. Hey, Yahaba. You think four heads will be enough for us to take home? Too many. We only need two. Demon Slayer and the fugitive. We have no use for the others. Huh. <sighs> Well, I'm still gonna have some fun before we take the Demon Slayer's head. Let's get that woman's head. Now! Die! Nezuko... Can she handle this? If Nezuko keeps one of them busy, it will be easier to focus on the other one. But... No, this isn't the time to be worrying. We just have to do it. Nezuko, you go after one of them. You just have to keep them distracted until then. <laughs> You're going to fight me on your own? How foolish. <laughs> My Tamari will rip a hole through your body. <laughs> <laughs> You're a stubborn one. How fun! I'm gonna play with you until you... Okay, time to get serious. You won't dodge this one! <laughs> You're the damn fast! <laughs> Hurry and bite the dust! <laughs> <laughs> She's actually managing to push her back. Yes. But both being demons, at this rate they'll be at a stalemate until dawn breaks. I must do something. <laughs> I think it's about time for you to disappear, you filthy little demon sl- And in the cruelest way imaginable. I have to calm down. I can't afford to get distracted. I just have to keep an eye out for opportunities to get closer until there's nowhere for him to run. Come on, I can do it! Pitiful 
Four. Four. I look at you, the filthier you seem. I won't let you get near me. He's using those arrows to keep me away. I can't let it throw me off. I have to keep pushing forward. I'm coming after you. Waterfall face it. Water wheel. Total concentration. Waterfall face it. Hold it. Waterfall face it. Water wheel. I'm coming after you. I'll make you pay for this. <laughs> Waterfall Basin! Waterfall Basin! Hold it! Let's try that again! I'm coming after you! Hold it! Could you stop kicking up dust everywhere? Do not irk me, you pathetic human. Even if I get covered in dirt, no matter how many times I fall down, it's okay, as long as I win in the end! I'm coming after you! Hold it! Waterfall Basin! Waterfall Basin! Water Wheel! I'm coming after you! This will end it! I'll make you pay for this! Hold it! Waterfall Basin! Waterfall Basin! Moving! an opening! Cut off his head! I know I can win this! Will you die already? <laughs> Time for you to die! Twist! Envelop! Twisting whirlpool! Flowing water! Not a chance! <laughs> My sword is so heavy! But I've got this! Second form, improve! I'll get his blood. I have to! I need that medicine! No matter what! I'll fight whatever demons I have to, and take out every single one! Ladder up! The water wheel! <laughs> I did it! Oh, you damn brat! I just needed to bring him your head. That's all it would have taken to finally win his approval! I'll never forgive you. I'll make sure you pay for what you've done to me! My face is filthy now! I swear I'll bring you down with me! Oh no! He's got me! Ah! I have to use every move I have to stop him! Or my body will be crushed! Fourth form! Striking Tide! Do something! Think fast! Don't get beaten! Not here! Water Wheel! Waterfall Basin! Water Surface Slash! Drop Ripple Thrust! Whirlpool! <sighs> I cracked my rib and broke my leg. It's no use. I'm so exhausted. I can't even hold my sword. I gotta go. I gotta get over there. There's one more demon left! Hang on. I'm coming. I'll 
I'll be there soon. Please be safe. Just hang on. Is it over? Is she dead? She will be momentarily. This is Kibutsuji's curse. The cells he left in her body rip her apart from the inside. Tanjiro, this demon we fought is not one of the Twelve Kizuki. What? The Twelve Kizuki all have numbers engraved on their eyeballs. Which means that the other demon likely doesn't either. They were too weak. Too weak? Really? But with any luck, this blood will still be instrumental for us in developing a cure. It's a bit strange. She's been acting like this ever since she woke up. I wonder if she's alright. She's just fine. If I were to guess... I'd say she thinks of you both as family. Thinks of us as family? But I thought the spell Nezuko was under only made her see humans as family. Yushiro and I are demons. Not to Nezuko. You two are as human as anyone to her. She wanted to protect you. You know, I didn't like the idea of that spell at first. But she still seems to have a will of her own, so... I'm so sorry! Nezuko, stop it! Get away from her! You're being very rude! Thank you. Thank you so much, Nezuko. Would you still desire to live? Even if it costs you your humanity? You will indeed succumb to your illness if you don't. But I must warn you. Losing your humanity, it is a painful experience. Yushiro and I will be leaving this region. It's far too risky to stay here now that Kibutsuji is so close. We need a new place to hide. And although I have been careful to keep my identity hidden, after treating so many humans, it is likely some of them have realized I am a demon. So, Tanjiro. Yes? In the interest of protecting Nezuko, would you like us to take her with us when we go? Huh? Obviously, I can't promise her safety, but I believe she'll be in less danger with us than she would in battle. Maybe she's right. Wherever they end up, Nezuko would be safer with them. They're dead. Worthless, incompetent demons. Oh. 
I'll follow you to the ends of hell! And my blade will be the last thing you see! Damn brat. I'll put an end to you someday. Let's go, Nezuko. Right then, where should we head next? Oh! Tanjiro Kamado! I bring you new orders! South Southeast from Osaksa! There's a mansion full of demons! You must break into it and destroy them! A mansion full of demons? Go pretending like we know each other, cause we don't, okay? Uh, but we have met, don't you remember? Don't get angry at me when you're the one with the terrible memory! Alright, you're all set to head home again. Do you need help with anything else? No, thank you very much. Hang on! Don't you interfere! That girl is madly in love with me! The two of us are gonna get married! Why did I say anything even resembling that I loved you? All I did was come talk to you while you were crumpled up all disheveled on the side of the road! Huh? No! So are you telling me the reason you did that wasn't because you were falling in love with me? Considering that I already have a fiancé, that's exactly what I've been trying to tell you! Well, you seem perfectly fine now, so goodbye! Wait! Come back! Please! Would you give it a rest already? Why did you have to get in my way? This had nothing to do with you! Why are you looking at me like that? Stop it! You're staring at me like I'm some sort of pitiful creature or something! Now listen here, you! I just lost my chance to get married, and it's all your fault! Say something, would you? Look! During my next job, I'll probably die. The reason is, I'm just a weakling. Do you understand? You have to help protect me until I manage to get married, mister! My name is Tanjiro Kamado, and you are... Tanjiro? That's good to know! I'm Zenitsu Akatsuma. Please, you've got to do what you can to save me! Aren't you being a bit dramatic? Why did you even become a swordsman? You're acting utterly pathetic right now. That's a harsh way to put it. I got conned by a woman and racked up a lot of debt. The old geezer who took it over for me was this toughest nails instructor. He made me train to the bone every day. It was so hellish, I just wanted to die. I was hoping that happened during final selection. But since I survived, this nightmare continues to haunt me. Ah, I'm so scared, terrified, frightened. I just know I'm going to get eaten by a demon. My brains are going to get sucked through my ears while I'm still alive. Hey, are you... okay? <laughs> I know what you mean when you say that you're terrified of demons, but you should try not to worry your sparrow. Huh? You're saying it was distressed? How could you tell? Let's see. He says you're always whining about not wanting to go to work. 
And you're always hitting on girls, and you snore really loudly. <laughs> Wait, he said all that? You can understand bird language? Yeah. No way! You've got to be lying to me! Ah! Start running! Start running! Run, Tanjiro! Run, Zenitsu! Both of you must head to your next destination! Run, Tanjiro! Run, Zenitsu! Ah! That crow is talking to us! Come on, let's get going. What? How can you be so calm right now? So, you were heading to the mansion south-southeast of here, too? Yeah... Are we gonna work together on this? Sounds like it. Let's go! Hey, Tanjiro. Don't you think it's weird to take orders from a crow? Hmm... I was a little surprised at first, but I'm used to it now. How do you just get used to something like that? Crows aren't supposed to talk! That's so freaky! I guess so, but it's pretty helpful. You'll get used to it soon enough. I don't know, man. A mansion. Is this the place? Huh? <laughs> there are kids here? They look scared. Hey there! Is there a reason you're out here by yourselves? <laughs> I'm Tanjiro Kamado, and this is Zenitsu Agatsuma. What are your names? Sh Shoichi and Teruko. Shoichi and Teruko? Those are nice names. Talk to me. Did something happen? Is this your house? No. No, it's not. This is... This house is... It belongs to a monster. Our big brother got taken away. We were walking down the road at night, and this thing appeared in front of us. It went straight for our brother, never giving us a glance. Did it take him into this house? Yeah, that's right. So you two followed them here? That's real brave. Great job. We used the traces of his blood to follow them. That thing really hurt him. He's hurt. It'll be all right. We're gonna go defeat the bad guy and save your brother. Is that true? You'll help him? Yes, I promise. Hey, Tanjiro. Uh, what is that strange sound? It's really unnerving and never stops. It sounds like a... drum. A drum? I don't hear anything. <laughs> That's the roar of a demon! It must be the one in the house! Let's go, Zenitsu! <laughs> Look, the only people who can help them are you and me now. <laughs> All right, then. Have it your way. Uh, hey! Tanjiro, don't be so scary! Fine, I give in! You win! I'll come along with you, okay? I won't force you to go. In case you run into trouble, I'm leaving this box. If you need help, it'll protect you. Okay, we'll be back. <laughs> I smell demons. More than just one. There must be several of them in here. So, Tanjiro, hey, before we continue, 
Whatever's in this place with us, you'll be sure to protect me from it, won't you? Zenitsu, I hate to have to tell you this, but in my last fight, I broke a leg and a rib. Neither of them have fully healed up as of yet, so... Wait, what? You've broken bones? What do you mean you have broken bones? If you're that bad, hope it's all over for me! I'm gonna d d d die This is horrible! What am I gonna do? I'm finished! Through! I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead! Senitsu, you've gotta calm down. You'll be alright. No, it's true. You're gonna be fine. You're probably... Stay away! <laughs> you two shouldn't be here! We're, we're sorry. There were sounds coming from inside that box. Oh no, you can't leave that box all alone. It's more precious to me than my own life. Ah! Oops, sorry. The room changed. Or did we teleport somehow? It happened on the beat of that drum. Sorry you two got separated, but I'm gonna protect you no matter what. And Zenitsu will protect your brother, don't worry. Okay. Come on, let's go. Follow me, alright? There's a strange smell coming out of here. Just barely smell the demon here. <gasps> huh? Maybe this guy's blood demon art allows him to move things around the mansion. scent is growing stronger. Huh? Okay. The smell is getting stronger. I'm on the right track. scent is growing stronger. <laughs> Are you scared? No. I'm okay. Okay. The smell is getting stronger. I'm on the right track. monster could jump out at any second, but we're gonna be fine, right? Definitely. Just stay close, okay? Yeah. Poor things trembling in fear. Hang in there, Terrico. Among all 
all the different scents in this mansion. This is the strongest one. This demon has eaten so many. This one has to be the master of this place! If it hadn't been for them, those stupid kids and their meddling... Damn them. Why do all these unwelcome guests keep barging into someone else's home? Hey you! Listen up! I'm a demon slayer! Rank Mizunoto! Tanjiro Kamado! It's my duty to slay you! A rare blood child that I found myself. <coughs> Teruko! The floor became the walls! The room's been flipped! So this is his blood demon art! This entire mansion is his territory! <laughs> What's this? There's an odd scent, but it's not a demon. <laughs> Here I come! What? Who is that guy? He's wearing a boar's hide, and he's wielding Nichirine swords. Is he with the Demon Slayer Corps? All right, you monster. Die on the battlefield, so I can use you as a stepping stone! I'll kill you, get even more powerful, and soar to new heights! Infuriating. Just infuriating. Hope you're ready for me. Cause I'm coming through with a full rush! <laughs> Insects. <laughs> you're exum. Now die. Insects. Rotating right. Now die. Back left. Insects. Miserable vermin. I'm starting to understand. <laughs> We're in another room now? But that demon didn't strike his drum. So what does this mean? I'm picking up the scent of multiple demons in this house. Is there another demon with a drum then? It's gonna be fine. You just stay behind me. <sighs> I smell demons. Stay focused. Don't lose the scent. I just need to follow the trail and take him down. Okay. Huh? And the smell. It's Zenitsu. It has to be. He came this way. The scent is still fresh. He must have just been here. I'm also picking up traces of Teruko's brother. Good. They're together. Your brother will be safe with Zenitsu. Is that the boy with the yellow hair? Yep. The one who was crying and screaming in front of the mansion? Y yeah Is he gonna be okay? Of course he will. You should see him. He's amazing. I can tell from his scent. Zenitsu's got this. I'm gonna die! It's over, it's over, it's over! I just know it! I can't believe Tanjiro and I got separated! Teruku? You hear? Hey, hey, hey! You can't go around yelling like that! If the bad guy hears you and fights us, it's not gonna be pretty! Let's just go wait outside! Huh? Why would we do that? Are you trying to escape all by yourself? Huh? All this constant whining about dying. Aren't you a little ashamed of yourself? <laughs> it's pathetic to cling to the sleeves of a little kid. <laughs> Why does a coward like you have a sword on his hip in the first place? <laughs> Those words, they cut right to my core. <laughs> <laughs> ah! I saw something! A rat! 
Please don't jump out all of a sudden. I'm begging you. Calm down, Zenitsu. <laughs> the door. It just closed on its own. You saw it, right? Right? Nobody's here, right? Right? That's really freaky! This guy's totally useless. Guess it's all up to me. That. If I'd had a heart attack, you would have been directly responsible! You'd be a murderer, do you understand? Well, it's just that you've been sweating, gasping, and shivering really badly. What about it? I'm doing the best I can here, alright? Um, forgive me for saying this, but you're making me really nervous too. Oh no, I'm sorry! It's just, I feel like... We make too much noise here. That demon you saw might fight us, you know? That's why I think it'd be best to be as quiet as possible. Don't you think? <gasps> <laughs> A couple of kids. I bet you'll taste delicious. What did I tell you? It's just my luck we'd run into a demon! Zenitsu, you gotta get up! Ah, my knees! My fear is in my knees! Just leave me behind, okay? Make a run for it! I can't do something like that! What a sweet kid. As useless as I am, he's sticking by me. I gotta find a solution to this. If I don't protect him, I don't want to think of what'll happen. Dying before he reaches a don't hold would be tragic. But I'm so horribly weak. I don't have the strength to protect him. Get up! But if I don't, then that would mean... <laughs> I'll slurp your brains out through your ears, and I'm going to relish it. Zenitsu! Are you... <sighs> He's asleep. <laughs> Zenitsu? <laughs> What's wrong with this kid? <laughs> First four, thunderclap and flash. First four, thunderclap and flash. Yeah, not bad. He's not just 
pretending he's really out cold. But somehow, he's fighting like the best of them. Come! Thunder breathing. First form. Thunderclap and flash. talking about you say something no yeah <laughs> it's no use i've lost track of zenitsu and shoichi's scent they must have been moved by that drum. My brother... Where is he? Huh? Okay! smell a human. A different one. It's a familiar scent. Where did I smell this before? Oh, it was him! That swordsman who burst through the wall while we were facing the drum demon! Damn it! He sent me flying again! These last three days, it's been the same old crap! I don't like sneaking around a cramped building like this. Just not my thing. I'm coming through with a bull rush! I don't care who! Just come and fight me! Whoever shows up will be my next prey! <laughs> I don't care who I gotta fight! Come at me! You 
seem quite spry, human. Die, and become my stepping stone! <laughs> You've got a lot of guts to charge me head on like that! Your healthy flesh will be well worth gouging out to eat. It's gonna feel so good to rip such a huge target to shreds! They'll catch you to shreds! I'll crush you! This I can't smell Zenitsu or the boar guy anymore. I know which way the drum demon is. But the room swapping makes it hard to navigate. <laughs> the drum beat. We're in another room now. Huh? Is that... I smell a human. Someone other than the boar guy. Are they hurt? I smell blood. But it's... different. I've never smelled blood quite like this before. I'm scared. I'm scared. It's okay. I'm with you. I'll keep you safe. And this smell... I think it might be. Let's hurry. This is it. This is where the smell's coming from. I'm Tanjiro Kamado. I'm a demon slayer. You hung in there really well. Can you show me your wounds? Tell me exactly what happened, if you can. Uh, a monster dragged me away, and it almost ate me. But then, another one showed up out of nowhere. They started fighting to the death. Fighting over who was gonna get to... eat me. Then, 
the demon with the drums growing out of him, left one of them behind after he was defeated by the others. When I picked it up and hit it, the room changed. That's how I held out. A demon with drums growing from him? That guy... I think he said something about rare blood. Yes, that's right. I don't really get it, but he called me that. Ah! The term rare blood refers to a special kind of human. Ah! <laughs> You're here too? The blood of all living species can be broken into types, you see. The more scarce the blood, or the more uncommon it is, I should say, the more desirable it is to demons. For you see, in terms of nutritional value for a demon, a rare blood is akin to eating as many as a hundred normal humans. A rare blood is like a bountiful feast for them, a delicacy for the ages. I'm gonna head out there. <sighs> Keep calm. It's all right. I'm going to take down that demon. Teruko, listen to me. Your brother is really worn out at the moment. So watch after him, all right? As soon as I leave this room, use the drum to change areas, just like Kiyoshi's been doing. If someone tries to open the door, or you hear something, strike that drum to remove yourself from danger. I promise that I'll come for you. I'll follow your scent back, then I'll call your name so you know it's me. Great. S <sighs> I'm off. Strike it! What a strong smell. The drum demon must be close. have to take down that demon before he claims any more victims! It's okay. I know I can do it! Okay! Huh? The smell is overwhelming. There's no mistaking it. The drum demon is right here! <laughs> Miss Tamayo did treat my wounds, but these injuries aren't fully healed yet. I'm in so much pain, I don't know how much longer I can hold on! This whole time, I've just been grinning and bearing it. When I pulled Zenitsu off of that girl, when I shouted at him, through all of it, I was enduring terrible pain. I had to push through it. It was my duty as the eldest son of my family. It'll be okay, Tanjiro. Believe in yourself! I'm the eldest son! I can almost taste it. Rare blood. I need it to devour even one. I would have as many as fifty, nay, a hundred bodies worth. I must search for more rare bloods and devour them. In doing so, I will be able to reclaim my place. It's one of the twelve Kisuki. There you are, drum demon! Damn insects. So infuriating. Burn some pest. Maddening. Infuriating. Insects. Damn insects. It's my duty to slay you! Die, insect! Good. 
I'm not in the best shape right now. If I charge forward to get within striking distance, I'm afraid that a flash of pain will make me falter. If that happens... I'll be torn to shreds! Trespass my home with those filthy shoes. You'll regret that when I tear you to pieces, you insolent insect. <clears throat> Stop moving so fast that I can't react. Stay calm and watch carefully. It's a worm. Get out of my way. <laughs> Hold it. I noticed something about those drums the first time you fought. The right shoulder flips the room to the right. And the left shoulder flips it left. The right leg flips it forward. And the left leg flips it backward. Come on his belly launches that claw attack! Waterfall Basin! Yes! I've got him now! I'm coming after you! Help my hands on that prayer and reclaim my rightful place among the twelve Jesus! That demon's attack is leaving tears that look like claw marks! I'm too scared to move in closer! Damn insect! Get out of my sight! Curses! This is irritating. I need to consume a rare blood before it's too late. Keep moving forward. Stay sharp! Give it everything you've got! You can do it! I've been able to survive this long! I know I have what it takes! Whether it's today or tomorrow, broken bones or not! Without a shadow of doubt in my mind, I will not yield! I'll get my hands on that rare blood and reclaim my rightful place among the Twelve Kizuki. Die, insect! I'm so powerful! Hold it! Boy, answer me. Did you really think 
My blood demon art was incredible. I truly did. However, killing innocents is unforgivable. I see. Oh, that's right. Gotta get a blood sample. This thing is incredible. Goes to show how crafty Yushiro really is. <laughs> a cat! Oh, you're the one who's going to deliver this to Miss Tamayo, right? You're all set. All right, take care. Oh, I was told that under Yushiro's spell, it would be invisible until it meowed, and then vanish again when it meowed a second time. May your soul rest in peace. I've got to find the kids. Kyoshi! Teriko! Tanjiro! You did a great job hanging in there. Come on, let's head outside. How's your leg feeling? Not too bad. I'm picking up Zenitsu and Shoichi scent. They'll probably be outside. Seems they're both safe. I smell blood. Come on! Move it! Now, you spineless coward! Draw your sword and face me! Tanjiro, the box, I protected it. You told me this was more important to you than your own life. That's why I did it. If you keep getting in my way, then I got no choice but to take you out Stop with it! it. Huh? Sound! Did you just fracture your skulls? <laughs> huh? Are you kidding me? That's what you look like? The hell are you saying? You got a problem with my face or something? There is nothing wrong with your face. In fact, the girlish shape, size, and complexion are quite attractive. You're a dead man! You wanna go? I don't! I... Thank you, Tanjiro! Thank you so much, Tanjiro! And thank you too, Zenitsu. Sh Shuichi! Are you going to leave? No, you can't! I won't allow it! Don't go, Shuichi! Please, you gotta stay with us! I've seen how powerful you are! I need you around to protect me from danger! Stop it! He's obviously not interested! Don't leave me behind, Shuichi! I beg you! Stop that this instant! You take care now. We will! <gasps> He's awake! Fight me! 
fight me now! A Wisteria family crest. Ah! It's time to rest! It's time to rest! You've all had a tough day! Rest up now! This house with the Wisteria family crest belongs to a family that was rescued by demon slayers! They'll house you free of charge. Is it really okay for us to rest? I suppose I have been ignoring my injuries. <laughs> Is that a laugh or... Hello? Uh, hello? Yes? Oh, sorry to bother you this late at night. Shall I presume that you all are demon slayers? Please come in. Who would have guessed? All three of us have broken ribs. This bump hurts a lot worse. Sorry. Excuse me, where's my apology? I'm hurting too. You beat the crap out of me earlier. You sorry? Nope. Just apologize! Forget it! I didn't join the Demon Slayer Corps to make friends. Why did you join then? Huh? Well, you must have had some kind of reason. A member of the Demon Slayer Corps barged in on me on my mountain, so he competed to see who was stronger. I took his blade as a reward. And then, I heard of this thing called Final Selection. I found out demons really exist. So that's what drew you to the Demon Slayer Corps. And hey, you grew up in the mountains. Same goes for me. Don't lump me in with you! I don't have anyone I could call family. Only one thing gives me comfort in this world. And that's testing my strength against others! Is that so? How sad. Hey, Tanjiro. There's something I've been meaning to ask you. You're traveling with a demon. What is that about? Zenitsu, you knew, and you still protected the box. You really are a good person. You know that? Thank you. You, you don't have to compliment me like that. <laughs> I've got a keen sense of smell. That's how I knew from the start. You're a kind person, Zenitsu. Strong, too. Hey, I'm not that strong. Give me a break. That's why I wanted to bring Shoichi along with us, but you ruined it. Uh, but I... <laughs> What's happening? Is it coming after us now? You don't have to worry. <laughs> it escaped! Huh? Huh? I'll introduce you. Nezuko is my... Tanjiro, how could you? Just who do you think you are? Huh? You've been traveling with a cute girl all this time. You must have had a great time hanging out together, huh? Why did I bear all that pain and suffering? You're a jerk, Tanjiro! 
I didn't go through all that just so you two could be all lovey-dovey every day! Was that really why I let myself be pummeled and kicked around by a crazy boar guy? Zenitsu, calm down. What's gotten into you? Did you think the Demon Slayer Corps would be all sunshine and rainbows? Guys like you should be erased from this world! Annihilated! I will finally make you pay for thwarting my marriage and for sending off my savior and protector, Shoichi! You shall face justice! Don't you ever disrespect the car! You fiend! You are the lowest of the low! <laughs> Zenitsu, cut it out! Mock the Demon Slayer core, and you'll be sent straight to hell! Feel my wrath! After that, Zenitsu kept berating me well into the night. Over and over again. Hold on, Zenitsu! I don't know what you're talking about! Of course you don't! A lucky guy like you could never understand my pain! Bring her back! That woman I was going to marry, bring her back to me! And while you're at it, get Shoichi too! Look, you need to calm down! I don't even know why you're so upset! Why do you think, you two-faced monster?! Eventually, Zenitsu wore himself out and we all fell asleep. Between the broken bones and general fatigue, I came down with a slight fever. Father's health has always been frail, right? So how can he be out in the snow and still keep dancing and dancing? There exists a breathing technique. One that will prevent you from ever exhausting yourself. Nesuko? I'm sweating. I guess it's the fever. Thanks. You took care of me because you were worried about me, huh? Hmm? <laughs> that dream really takes me back. My father used to do Kagura. It was a beautiful, flowing form of dance. I remember what he said. <laughs> Nezuko! Cut it out, Zenitsu. Tanji ro <laughs> Nezuko is your little sister. That makes you her big brother. <laughs> Let's be best friends, Tanjiro! Zenitsu, why are you following us around like this? Stop it! Oh, come on. Don't be a stranger, Tanjiro. Man, I'm hungry. Pardon me, good sir, but what would you like for dinner? I was thinking of making some tempura. You know, something covered in batter and fried golden brown. Listen up now! North, northeast! North, northeast! Your next mission is north, northeast! Tomorrow morning, go to Mount Natagomo! Go to Mount Natagomo! Uh, right when we finally started to feel better. All right! You can count on me! Mount Natagomo. 
I've never heard of that place before. How may I assist you? Which Hashira are available right now? That would be Giyu and Shinobu, sir. Bring them here. At once, sir. Tensions may escalate beyond our expectation. Tread carefully, my demon slayers. We're heading out. Thank you for everything. I'll bestow good luck upon you. What do you think you're doing? Inosuke! Stop that, you idiot! It's ceremonial! We're going on a journey, and striking sparks is for luck! Huh? Always live your lives in a fashion where you are able to hold your heads up high. I wish you luck in battle. The hell's that even me? Can you just drop it? Let's go! Thank you. Heads up high? Luck in battle? What's that mean? To be honest, it is a little bit difficult to explain. I guess it means whatever hand you're given in this life, you're able to conduct yourself in a way that's honorable, so you're never ashamed. And wishing us luck in battle just means she's praying for our safety. Well, what about the hand you're given? We have two already! And why should we be ashamed? Well, I guess... What does honorable mean anyway? And why is that old hag praying for our safety in the first place? She has nothing to do with us! So what's her game, huh? Let's get going! Huh? Okay! Everyone! We need to pause here! Zenitsu? What's wrong? I'm nervous, okay? Now that we're nearing our destination, I'm getting scared! Why the hell is he sitting like that? It's pretty weird if you ask me. <laughs> what is the smell? <laughs> Help me! Please help me! Look at his uniform! That guy! He's one of us! Are you alright? What happened? <laughs> they were attached to me too! Please don't let me die here! What's going on here? I'm going in. I'll head in first. You stay behind me, trembling like a scared little animal. This is making me hungry. <laughs> Here we go. <clears throat> There's an incredibly pungent odor on the wind. I can't pick up a scent trail like this. This won't tell me where the demons are. Now more than ever, we've got to proceed carefully. This place is full of cobwebs everywhere you-
We've got to find them. And soon. Ha! That's what happens to a small fry like him. I'd never get caught like that. to find the advance party that came into these hills first. I'll take down that demon and save everyone as fast as I can. The air here is giving me chills. It's like there's an aura of terror surrounding the mountain. Okay! I'm really glad Inosuke's here with me. dragged us all the way up the mountain, but there's nothing here! The hell are you trying to pull, Monjuro? There are demon slayers in there. Huh? We've come to help out. I'm Tanjiro Kamado, rank Mizunoto. Mizunoto? Are you serious? They should have sent us a Hashira! No matter how many Mizunoto they send in, it won't be enough! Big talk from the guy who pissed his pants! Now how about you tell us just what is going on here? The... Crow gave us orders... to come to this place. And ten of us Demon Slayers gathered here. Not long after we entered the mountain, that's when it started. My teammates started killing each other! <laughs> you have to go and bring a higher ranked member! If you don't, I'll end up killing everyone! I beg 
you! Please! These guys morons or something! They don't know that it's taboo for us demon slayers to fight each other! That's not it. They're acting odd. Like... Like they're being controlled. <laughs> There's a strange, sweet scent coming from her back. A thread? That's it! Threads! Inosuke, they're being controlled with threads! I already figured that out! There must be a demon controlling them! But where? <clears throat> that horrible smell again! What is it? Inosuke, there are too many of them! We gotta find the demon who's controlling them instead! This disgusting smell is all around us! My nose isn't going to work like this! Listen, if you have some kind of power that can pinpoint the demon's location, that would really help! And you there, your name! It's Murata! Murata! The two of us will take care of the people being controlled! In the meantime... <laughs> I will not let you disturb my family's peaceful life. He's floating? No. He's standing on the threats. Mother will be sure to make quick work of you all. Who's mother? I won't let anyone get in our way. The five of us are going to live in happiness as a family. No one on this mortal plane will tear us apart. Where the hell do you think you're going? Fight me! Fight me! I don't think he's the demon who's controlling our people with those threats. We can't focus on him now. Okay, okay, okay. I get it, all right? You want me to go find the one who is? Shut up about it already. Beast breathing. Seventh form. Spatial awareness. I found you. You demon! That way! They can't hide from... Did you find them? That's amazing, Inosuke. You found the enemy? Then leave these guys to me and go on ahead, Tanjiro. Huh? I know I wasn't very brave back there. But I'm still a demon slayer. I'll find a way to hold them off. There have to be people who are under even greater control near the demon. You have to help them. Got it. Stay strong. I'll just destroy them all in one shot. <laughs> the closer an individual is to me, the stronger these threats become, as do my precious dolls. Mother... Can you really win? <gasps> really? Don't you think this is taking too much time? You'd better get to it. Or I'll have to tell father. No, I can do it! You don't have to worry! I promise to protect you! So please, whatever you do, don't tell your father! Not him! Then hurry it up. <laughs> I have no choice but to unleash that one, then. Over here! We're getting close! Now that the winds changed direction, my sense of smell is returning. There, I'm picking up two more sets. Something's there. Inosuke! I detected that thing before you did! It doesn't even have a head! That thing's got no weak spots! Where am I supposed to cut? What do we do? What do we do? Inosuke, this is a tough one, but we can do it! If we put our heads together, we'll be able to win! Damn it! It's got no weak spots! What the hell do I target? Stomach? Arms? Legs? Where? Waterfall Basin! Whirlpool!
Headless demon before. I've got to watch their movements and find an opportunity for a counterattack. I can do this. Hold it. Let's try that again. That was nothing. the spirit this will end it water breathing Transform! constant flux the flow of water never stops Get together let son call me boy damn it i'm the great ghostie I'm not gonna lose to some shitty demon that's misplaced its head! I'm the strongest! I'm more powerful than anyone else! Let's try- That was nothing! I'm coming after- Waterfall Payton! and strongest, and they still won. All right, Inosuke. <laughs> you did it. <sighs> Ascent? So that's why you did that. It's, it's Rui's fault for coming and threatening me. That's why I panicked. Water breathing! He's going to cut my head off for sure! What do I do? I have to think of something! First form! Although... If I die, I'll be freed. I'll find peace. Water breathing. Fifth form! Blessed rain after the drought. It's like I'm being showered by a gentle rain. It doesn't hurt. Not at all. I just feel warm. I never dreamed my end would be this tranquil. And now, I'll be released. eyes. Such kind eyes. Back when I was human, I think there was someone who used to look at me with those same gentle eyes. One of the twelve Kizuki is here. Be careful. <laughs> A member of the twelve Kizuki here? Just within my grasp. The twelve Kizuki should possess a high amount of Kibutsuchi's blood. If I can extract it, the medicine that'll help Nezuko will be finished sooner. <clears throat> Inosuke's still back there! So, did you take out that monster? Hey, are you okay? You're bleeding. Don't go showering me with your mushy sensitivity and kindness! That demon gave off a scent of terror and suffering, enough to make her yearn for death. What's going on on this mountain?
I wonder if the others hate me. Would someone normally leave their friend behind like this? You'd talk him through it if you were close, wouldn't you? If they had both tried to convince me to go, I would've. I'm sure of it. But instead, they both went on their merry way up that scary mountain, leaving poor little me all alone. <sighs> I bet Nezuko would have stayed in comfort. Yeah, she definitely. Wait. Spider webs everywhere I look. Nezuko doesn't belong in a place like this. She should be in. <laughs> a field of flowers. Wait, now that I think about it, am I all alone? But if I'm on my own, what am I supposed to do if a demon shows up? Where are you? <laughs> Why? Please don't fly around at night if you're not an owl. <sighs> Huh? What the heck? Um, is something coming after me? Hey, hold on a second! I'm definitely being followed! Stop! Just stop! My heart and legs are already trembling in fear! <laughs> ah! Don't just suddenly come falling down like that! Let my heart get prepared first! <laughs> Wait, can't I go this way? What the heck is this doing here? <sighs> Crap, crap, crap! Where did they go? I 
can't find them anywhere! Tanjiro! Where did you take my precious Nezuko? How can you do this? Something really stinks around here, too! Gross! And the sound of these spiders running around is so creepy! I'm sure they're just doing their best to survive the same as me, but still! Be quiet! Stop moving around! Spider have a human face on it! What is happening right now? What is happening? Please be a dream, please be a dream, please be a dream, please be a dream! If I wake up right now, I promise to work harder! If I were to wake up in the presence of my precious Nezuko, then I'll do anything! I'll do hard labor, I'll even plow fields, a whole acre! No, two! I promise! Let me wake up from this nightmare! What is happening right now? What is happening? Are those humans who got turned into spiders? And is that house floating? I can't quite make it out, but are those threads? Oh, and it really stings! Talk about pungent. Tanjiro would hate this for sure. The smell is making my throat hurt. Not just that, it's irritating my eyes too. talking to me! I don't want to hear anything from you! <laughs> You've already lost the battle! I told you not to talk to me! I don't want to hear it, so stop talking! Things like you give me the creeps, all right? Take a look at your hands. <laughs> my hands? Why? What's wrong with my hand? What the? You're poisoned. A spider bit you, didn't it? You're gonna turn into one before long. <laughs> In half an hour, you'll be my slave, crawling all over the ground. First, you'll start to feel tingling and pains in your limbs. <laughs> Next, you'll feel dizzy and nauseous. After that, your body will painfully start to shrink and you'll black out. And by the time you wake up, <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Shut up, shut up, you just shut up! There's no need to be afraid. Once the transformation has taken effect, you lose your humanity. Exactly! That's just what I've been dreading about all this! Why can't you get that through your head, huh? Someone like you wouldn't have anyone special in their lives! Ah, no, not that! I don't want to turn into one of those things! Ah. Get a hold of yourself! Stop crying and running away! Doing that isn't going to get you anywhere! Getting hit by lightning. How unlucky can you get? That's when my hair color changed. I hate myself more than anyone else. I always try to get my act together, but I just end up running away or cowering in fear. I want to change. I want to be a capable individual. The fact is, I'm already doing absolutely everything that I can! But in the end, I'm gonna lose all my hair and become a horrific spider creature?! What's up with this guy? He's a strange one! 
Oh, crap! Don't climb up here! Can't you leave me alone for just a little bit? Hey, are you even listening to me? Am I gonna turn into something as brainless as you guys? Ah! No, 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 no! Just give me a break already! <coughs> he fainted? How spineless can you get? Isn't he a demon slayer who came here to kill our family? He's gonna fall on his head and die! What the hell? Hmm? Believe in yourself. You endured all that hellish training. You'll be rewarded for that without question. What's this? His demeanor has completely changed. You need only master a single thing. Become your own blade. The strongest of all! What the? Get him!
first of all. Thunderclap down. Slashed? Me? It can't be! This is ridiculous! I was defeated by someone who could hardly move their limbs! <gasps> I just want a dream. A happy, peaceful dream. In it, I'm more powerful than anyone. I'm able to help the weak, anyone in trouble, anytime. And everything that Gramps taught me, all the time and effort he spent, it wasn't for nothing. In this dream, thanks to Gramps, I became strong and was able to help a lot of people. But. The time for dreams is over now. Don't ever give up! Don't ever give up. I can use the breathing technique to slow down the poison. Even if it's painful, even if it's agonizing, I can't take the easy way out, or Gramps will let me have it. Yeah. Taunt you all too. He'll yell at me for sure. Hello there. Who is that? Hello there. Are you all right? What was that sound? Did lightning just strike? How should I know? Well, I'm not smelling any thunderclouds. But that odor got stronger and is messing with my senses again. Hey, Kedro! Who gives a crap about that? Stop spacing out! The demons are still out there! Yeah, I know. Let's go. And it's Tanjiro! Tanjiro!
Who's next? That little wuss! I don't care who they are! Bring them on! Huh? Okay. You there! Huh?
I'll go for the neck! Live your lives in a fashion where you are able to hold your heads up high. I won't lose. No way I'm gonna lose! I'm Inosuke Hashibira of the Demon Slayer Corps! Give me the worst you got, you dirtbag! Get back here! 
Absolutely amazing! Who even is this guy? I still have goosebumps! Fight me, you dumb half and half howry! You beat that member of the 12 Kizuki! And now, right here, I'm gonna beat you! That's how this is gonna work! If I can manage that, that'll make me the most powerful of all! I have a better idea. Go train more. What'd you just say to me?! That wasn't even one of the 12 Kizuki. Could you not even tell that? Of course I could tell! For your information, it was Tanjiro who was saying it was one of them! I was just repeating what he said to me earlier! Huh? Whoa! <laughs> What the hell? When did he tie me up? If you are not aware of what state your body is in, you shouldn't be fighting. Ah, I can't hear you! Your voice is too soft and you're walking too fast! I said hold your horses! Get me down! That demon threw me really far. I've got to hurry and regroup with Inosuke. Just hold on. I'll be back soon. I wonder if Inosuke's all right. I hope he's not being too reckless. Okay, then. Hmm. <coughs> Screaming! It's coming from that direction! What are you looking at? This isn't a play, you know. What are you doing? Aren't you two... fighting on the same side? The same side? Don't go phrasing it in such an infantile manner. The two of us are family. We are connected by a powerful bond. Regardless of that, 
This is between me and my sister. If you insist on interfering, I'll carve you up. You're wrong. Family or comrade, as long as you feel close to one another, that's all that really matters. Calling such precious bonds childish, that's not true at all. Not only that, but those who are strongly connected with each other give off the scent of trust. All I'm picking up from you two is the scent of terror, hatred, and revulsion. That's not something you can call a bond. It's a fake. A forgery! Now then, what did you just say? I asked you, what did you say to me? <laughs> Look how scary he got. It feels like the air became ten times heavier. Inosuke, I'm sorry. I'm gonna need you to hang in there a little longer. I'll be there as soon as I defeat this demon. I'll come help you no matter what! I'll say it as many times as I have to! The bonds you have aren't real at all! Just so you know... I'm not going to kill you on a single strike. Instead, I'll dissect you piece by piece. However, if you take back what you said to me just now, I'll make your death mercifully quick. I refuse! What I said was the unbridled truth! I won't take it back, not on your life! You're the one who's in the wrong! I see. As I said, I'll tear you to pieces. No! I'm coming after you! You're a nuisance. Hold it! I'm coming after you! You're a nuisance. Hold it! Stay focused. I'm coming up. The way the threats move is making this a difficult fight. I must judge my timing even for an instant. I'll die. He may be strong, but I can't lose this fight. I've got to cut his head off. Fourth form. Strike. Keep your guard up. Stay alert. Can't lose focus. I want to give him a single opening. You have to watch his movements carefully! Really? This is your best. <laughs> Let me cut you to pieces. Come at me! You're a nuisance. Stay focused. You're a nuisance. You're a nuisance. No! You're a nuisance. I'm coming after you! Fourth form! Straight you die! He's smarter than I gave him credit for. He doesn't shrink back in fear. Water breathing! First form! Not that any of that will matter in the end. Water surface slash! <laughs> my... My sword's been broken. I can't believe it! Are... Are those threats he's controlling? Are they even tougher than the demons I've cut through? <laughs> I can't dodge this! Nezuko! Nezuko, hang in there. You protected me. Thank you. The girl emerged from that box and defended him. But I'm sure she's one of us.
sister! You can't abandon me! Shut up! None of you were able to fulfill the roles you were assigned. Not once in your entire life. Wait, brother! Wasn't I the elder sister that you wanted? Give me another chance! Very well, then. Go kill the humans wandering all over this mountain. If you do that, I'll forgive you for what just happened. Uh, all right. Yes, I'll do that. Boy, let's talk. Just the two of us. The truth is, what your sister did, I found it genuinely moving to behold. I doubt any words exist that describe exactly how I felt. However, your fate now is death. A disagreeable conclusion for you, no doubt. So listen close. I'll impart to you how you can escape your fate. I want you to give your sister to me. If you do so, then I will spare your life. I have no idea what you're talking about. As of today, instead of being your little sister, she's mine. You don't actually think I'd ever agree to that, do you? First off, Nezuko's not a thing! She has her own will and feelings! There's no way she'll ever be your sister! It's alright. You don't need to worry. I'm stronger than you. I will create a bond with her. One made of terror. She'll know what happens when I'm defied. I've had enough of you spouting this nonsense! Using fear to keep someone shackled to you isn't the bond of a family! And until you are able to figure that out, you'll never get what it is you desire! So irritating. Would you mind not shouting? It's clear we don't agree. I'll never hand Nezuko over to you! Very well then. I'll just take her after I kill you. Not if I manage to cut your head off first! Now that's the spirit. I would love to see you try. Let's see if you have what it takes to bring down one of the 12 Kizuki. Is Isis lower rank 5? As I thought, his power, he really is one of the 12 Kizuki. In a family, the father has his designated role to fulfill, and the mother has hers in turn. The parents protect their eldest children, and the eldest protect the younger ones. What are you even talking about? The way I see it, if you don't understand your own role in life, there's no reason in living it to begin with. As for you, I'll tell you your role. It is to relinquish your younger sister to me and disappear. If you refuse, your only other path is death. For you cannot defeat me. It won't be easy to cut those threads. But what do I do if his neck is even tougher? Not to mention my broken sword. That steely look in your eyes. I don't like it. What are you plotting? Don't tell me. You think you can defeat me? Ne Nezuko! Quiet down. This won't be enough to kill her. She's a demon. <laughs> Calm down. Don't get emotional. Concentrate. Control your breathing! <laughs> Don't be afraid. Get into his face and cut his neck. Then rescue Nezuko! Nezuko, please just hold on a little longer! I swear, I promise, your big brother will save you! That steely look in your eyes. I don't like it. What are you plotting? Wonderful reason! 
Threads are at maximum strength, do you? Blood demon art. Cutting thread cage. I have no more use for you. Farewell. Not good! I can't cut these threads! I don't have enough momentum! Something's wrong. Giving off a totally different scent than the other ones. This can't be how it ends. It can't. Am I really gonna die here? Am I? Tanjiro.
Break through, Tanjiro! You have to break through! It's like those threads have a life of their own! And he's weaving new ones faster than I can blink! But I can't hesitate. There are repercussions for forcefully switching from water breathing to Hinokami Kagura! If I stop now, I'll be rendered immobile for a time! That's why I need to keep pressing on! I can't let this moment slip by! My lungs! My legs! My strength! Give it everything I've got! Keep going! Keep pushing! Forward! Forward! He's charging without even minding the threads. Ridiculous. As if a strategy that stupid would work. But a stubborn threat. What's it going to take to finally bring him down? Even if it costs me my life, I'm going to take you down right here and now! Did it! My father... saved me. Our family's Kagura passed down for generations, somehow manifested itself into a technique. And that helped me defeat that demon. I beat him. I won. Nezuko... <sighs> My vision's blurry. And my whole body's throbbing with pain. Is it because I took too many breaths too fast? I... gotta catch... my second wind... and press on! I still... need to go help Inosuke... as soon as I can! <sighs> the scent of blood just became stronger. Don't tell me... he survived that, but I cut his head off! You thought you defeated me? How sad for you. Did your delusion bring you a brief moment of joy? I cut my head off myself using my own threads, before you were able to do the job yourself. Enough struggling. I'll kill both you and your sister. I haven't been this incensed in a long time. Get up! Get on your feet! You need to control your breathing! Hurry! There's no time! Now I'm going to carve you up without regret. Blood demon art. Murderous eye basket. Don't let your breathing be disrupted, Tanjiro! Hometown, just stay calm! My arm! I can't raise my arm! That's 
right. I... Every single day, I missed my parents so much I could barely stand it. Even after crafting a family of my own, that emptiness remained. Because I was the strongest, I couldn't depend on anyone to protect me. No one. The more powerful I became, the more distant my memories of being human became as well. I began losing sight of what it was I wanted in the first place. I sought out a bond that I was never able to claim for myself. Not in my old life, nor the new one I created. His body is giving off a scent, one of grief too overwhelming for him to bear. So warm. Hands. Gentle as sunbeams. Don't waste your sympathy. It was a demon. The fact it looked like a child makes no difference. It lived for decades, terrorizing our people. If it's for the sake of avenging people who were killed, to make sure there are no more victims, I won't hesitate to bring my blade down on any demon's neck. But when it comes to those who felt despair and regret from the actions they took as a demon, I will never disrespect them. Because at one time or another, they were human. No different from me! Aren't you too? Oh my! Why would you get in my way, Tomioka? And after you told me we could never be friends with demons, I have to say, this kind of thing is exactly why no one likes you. Now then, Tomioka, would you please move? People do like me. Oh dear, I do apologize. You're only just hearing about this now then? I'm sorry, I didn't mean for you to find out this way. Boy! Yes, ma'am! What you're protecting there is actually a demon. So please move away before you get hurt. No, you're mistaken. Well, you're not mistaken, but she's... She's my little sister. She's my sister, and that's why... Oh my, is that really true? You poor thing. In that case, so she won't suffer, I'll use a gentle toxin in order to kill her. <gasps> Can you move? Even if it's difficult, you need to go. Take your sister and run. Tomioka, thank you. I appreciate this. Did you just break the rules of the core? <laughs> Tomioka. Oh, that's right. He's the one we met before. Tomioka's the one who introduced me to Uro Kodaki. Back when Nezuko was first turned into a demon. I had no idea what to do back then. And now, he's saving us again! I can't ever thank him enough! My whole body... is aching so much, I want to scream! But I have to keep going, and endure it! Don't stop running! Keep on moving! You've got to run away! This forest!
Tomioka, this is clearly against the rules. You're preventing me from slaying a demon. What are your intentions here? Don't you have anything to say for yourself? As I recall, it was two years ago. Are you about to go into a long-winded story from the past just to spite me? It's because of what I said to you earlier, is that it? <laughs> I'm sure that even after this, there are some who cannot accept Nezuko. Work towards changing their minds. Prove them wrong. Hey, you're awake! You passed out cold the second we moved you here. Everyone was worried because you weren't waking up. Figures I'd be the one who'd have to watch you. I always said you were pretty out of it, but... Well, I guess she was right. I see. What's wrong? My head just feels a little... foggy. I can't really remember what happened. Oh, is that all? After all that, he's gonna act this way? How arrogant is this kid? My stomach hurt so bad the whole time. After the mission on Mount Naragumo. That's right, I... Hey! Come on! Get up! Are you gonna sleep the whole dang day? Just wake the hell up, will ya? <laughs> You're in the presence of the Hashira! I heard he was a demon slayer with a demon in tow. I was expecting someone with a bit more flair. But it's just some ordinary looking kid. We must see that this boy is put on trial to be judged. So it shall be! To think that he's been protecting his sister who was turned into a demon! What a brave and beautiful display of sibling love! What? Who are all these people? Don't open your mouth until you're told! Do you know who you're in the presence of? These are the Hashira! The Hashira? I have no idea what that is. Who are all these people? Where even am I? This is the Demon Slayer's headquarters. You are here because you, Tanjiro Kamado, are to be put on trial. Before we begin the trial, why don't you explain the crime you have been accused There's of? There's no need for a trial! 
Protecting a demon is a clear violation. We can deal with this on our own. We shall execute them both. In that case, I'll decapitate them with style. I'll show you the most dramatic spray of blood ever. It'll be a spectacle. No way! You'd really kill a child as adorable as him? Such a thought fills my heart with sorrow. Alas, to see such a pitiful creature as this, I grieve for him. Perhaps it would have been better had he not been born at all. But those clouds... What do you call them when they're shaped like that? I can't remember. Wait... Where's Nezuko? Hey... The Hashira are speaking. What are you looking at? Your eyes should be over there! These are the nine highest ranking swordsmen in the Demon Slayer Corps! Those are the Hashira? Hey! Nezuko! Where did you take her? Nezuko! Senitsu! Hinosuke! Murata! Never mind this boy. What will we do with Tomioka? Seeing him standing there without any restraints is making me feel ill. Based on what Kocho told us, he's just as guilty of breaking the Corps' rules. How should we make him take responsibility? What kind of lesson shall we teach him? Igoro, you're as sharp-tongued as ever, I see. I love that side of you. Look at Tomioka over there, all alone and stoic-like. What a cutie! Oh, I think it's fine. He did come here without resisting. Let's come up with a penalty later. What I'm more interested in is hearing this boy's story. He's in this situation because of me. Tanjiro Kamado, as a fellow demon slayer, for what purpose are you traveling with a demon? You can take your time. Just answer the question. She's my... my young... <coughs> you look like you need some water. I can tell you've injured your jaw, so please, drink slowly. I added an anesthetic to the water to help. Your wounds are still healing, so it would be best if you didn't push yourself. Are you ready to tell us your story now, Tanjiro? That demon... is my little sister. My family was attacked by a demon while I was gone, and I lost them all. Except for her. She may be a demon, but she's never hurt anyone. She never has, and she never will. She'll never harm a human being no matter what! Enough. Spare us the absurd ramblings. Anyone would defend their family. Why should I believe a single word you say? Sorry, but I'm not buying it. Please, just listen to me! I became a swordsman in hopes of finding her a cure. It has been two whole years since Nezuko became a demon, and she hasn't ever eaten anyone. Your storytelling is lacking any vibrant sparks of color. She hasn't eaten anyone, and she never will. If you're gonna plead your case, at least make it interesting to listen to. Excuse me. Something about this concerns me. I find it hard to believe the Master would have been unaware of this situation. I don't think we should act without his permission. Maybe it's best if we wait until he arrives. My sister... Let my sister stay by my side! She can fight to protect humans as a demon slayer! I know she can! So please! Well, well, well. What exactly do we have brewing over here? Is that the moron who's been traveling with a demon? <sighs> Start talking. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Oh, those new scars make Shinazugawa look even more handsome! 
Go on. Say that again, kid. She can fight to protect humans as a demon slayer. Isn't that what you said? You know what we call that? Being completely out of your mind, you idiot! <laughs> Anyone who harms my sister answers to me! I don't give a damn if you're one of the Hashira! <laughs> Is that supposed to scare me? Cease this at once. The Master will be here at any moment. The Master of the Mansion has returned. My beloved children, I thank you for coming here this day. <laughs> Good morning to you all. The weather is strikingly nice today. Perhaps with the blue sky, finding ourselves here, at our semi-annual gathering, with all the same faces, it brings me joy. He looks wounded. No, sick maybe? Is he really their master? The master. The Hashira. Nezuko. Nezuko. Where's Nezuko? Huh? Your sister is right there. She's been asleep the whole time. Makes sense, given everything that's happened. R right Okay. <sighs> you look like you're still a little groggy. Why don't you go for a walk and wake yourself up? We'll be safe here in the Butterfly Mansion. And I'm pretty tired of watching over you. I'll go tell everyone you're awake. If you see anyone around, make sure you greet them properly. Oh, okay. Thank you. Sure thing. Just feel better soon, okay? A proper greeting. Okay. Looks like I've got everyone worried. Let's go. In the Butterfly Mansion. Huh? Nope. Is that... Hmm... What's this? Huh? Is that... Okay. I'm so glad you're awake. Uh, 
Thank you. I'm sorry to be a burden. This place is for treating those who have been wounded in the line of duty. It's our job to take care of you. There is no need to apologize. Oh, well, thank you very much then. Though you are awake, your body may not yet be back to normal. You need to keep resting to ensure a full recovery. Understand? Yes, I'll do my best. Is this really the same boy who made such a fuss at the Hashira meeting? I don't smell anything that stands out. Oh, Zenitsu, Inosuke! Oh, Tanjiro, you sure look like you're up and refreshed. What are you two doing here? What do you think? We're lying in the sun. There's nothing for us to do. And, well, just look at Inosuke. I'm sorry for being so weak. Uh, oh. Anyways, you met the Master, right? Oh, what was she like? What'd you think when you first saw her? Oh my gosh, please tell me she was a beauty. The Master is a man. I've lost interest in this conversation. Thank you. Sorry to worry you all. How are your wounds, Tanjiro? Oh, uh, they're okay. It doesn't hurt much anymore. I'm so glad to hear that. But that doesn't mean you can go and do anything strenuous. Yeah, Shinobu will get mad at you. Got it. I'll take it easy for a while. Tomioka helped me on my mission again. I should thank him one of these days. It's just as you've all reported. 
The demon's carnage has reached an all-time high. This means the threat to human life is greater than it has ever been before. We must bolster the ranks of the demon slayers. Now, what are your thoughts? The incident on Mount Nadaguma says it all. The caliber of demon slayers has dropped tremendously. Most of them are completely useless. The trainers must have gone blind. You'd think they could at least tell if someone's competent or not. The more the human race grows, the harder it becomes to control and unify them. And in this era, that seems to be especially true. We have those who've joined us after their loved ones were slaughtered. And those who have hunted demons for generations. But for the others, it's another matter entirely. Asking laymen for the same or even greater commitment to our cause. I feel this would be much too cruel. But we must consider that this boy, soon after joining, encountered one of the Twelve Kizuki. I think he can draw them out. Even we rarely get the chance to confront one. I am envious! A fair point. However, the fact that lower rank 5 made such a drastic move likely means Kibutsuji is far from Mount Narakumo. Like with the Saksa, whenever he wishes to hide something, he proceeds to create a clever diversion to throw us off his trail. To be honest, it's quite frustrating. But as long as these demons linger as they do now, freely devouring humans and gaining strength as a result, there is only one thing for us to do, for the sake of those who have died. I feel you who are present today, the Kors Hashira, are the finest unit I have assembled since the Swordsmen of the Feudal Era. The very first to use breathing techniques. Tengen Uzui. Kyojuro Rengoku. Shinobu Kocho. Mitsuri Kanrochi. Uichiro Tokito. Gyome Himejima. Sanemi Shinazugawa. Obana Igoro. Giyu Tomioka. My beloved children. I look forward to seeing your success. It had been a few days since I'd arrived at the Butterfly Mansion, and my body was recovering nicely. Shinobu, the insect Hashira, smiled as she told me what was next. Let's have you start your rehabilitation training. Rehabilitation training. At the time, I didn't know what to expect. But it was so hard. Seriously, like having my heart torn out from my chest. First, they stretched us out to the point of tears. Then, Aoi and Kanaho put us through the ringer, with a combination of reflex training and full body tag practice. We had to keep doing it, day after day. But... Uh, we never won. Kanaho is especially hard to beat. With their spirits broken, Zenitsu and Inosuke stopped coming to training. I'm not very skilled, so I figured the only thing I could do is keep giving it my all. But one day, Kiyo, Naho, and Sumi gave me a piece of advice. Kanaho 
concentration breathing non-stop. We're told that doing so makes all the difference in the world. It's called total concentration, constant. And it was totally new to me. It's a hell of a technique. Being able to remain in that state around the clock, there was no way I could defeat Kana'o without it. And to achieve such power, your lungs need to be strong enough to break a giant gourd. With that goal in mind, my path was set. The only thing left was to put in the work. I'm the kind of person who keeps on trying, pushing forward bit by bit. Perseverance is the only thing I have! And sure enough, as the days passed, I started to get the hang of it. After a lot of struggle, I finally managed to maintain my total concentration breathing. And ever since then, it's become a little more natural for me. I've decided, it's time to try breaking that gourd. This'll be the ultimate test of my new power. I can probably... No, I will definitely do it! All right. I feel good about this. My body's gotten used to maintaining the total concentration. I'm gonna break that gourd. <sighs> They're gone. When are Zenitsu and Inosuke going to get back to training? I should go outside. Good morning. Oh, good morning, Shinobu. Starting your training for the day? Actually, I want to test my constant breathing by trying to break a gourd. I see. It's a bit embarrassing when she stares at me like that. With how hard you've been training, you might see good results. Really? All right! I've got this! Tanjiro. Yes? I've said this before, but good luck. I have high hopes for you. Yes, ma'am. I'll do my best. Hey, Tanjiro. Zenitsu. You gonna start training again soon? Everyone's waiting. They're worried about you. Training? Oh, I'm over that now. The girls were nice and all, but I couldn't even get within arm's reach of Kano. I did everything I could. Oh well. Come to think of it, where's Inosuke? Was he not with you? Oh, he's off playing in the mountains. Well, it's about time I find somewhere to hang out to. Let's see, where should I go today? <laughs> I can't wait! This is hopeless. I've got to finish my training so I can show them the ropes. Oh. All right, today's the day. Huh? 
What's this? Huh? Okay. Is that... Did you need me for something? Yes, we thought you might like to try breaking a gourd. We were waiting for you. Whoa, how did you know? We've been watching you every day. We can just tell. Am I really that transparent? In any case, it feels nice to know they're looking out for me. I appreciate it. All right, time to try it out. Good luck, Tanjiro. Blowing so much air into a gourd that it breaks. When I first heard that, I thought it was impossible. But now I know that the longer I'm able to keep up my total concentration breathing, the stronger my body gets. Maybe I can actually do it! it without your help. Tomorrow, I'll ask Kano for a rematch. Maybe I can... No, I'll definitely beat her. The next day, I went to the dojo first thing in the morning and challenged Kanaho to another round of full-body tag training. And just like always, Kanaho was as fast as lightning. But since I finally mastered total concentration breathing constant, I actually managed to catch her. All that's left now is reflex training. 
A battle to splash the other with tea! Are you free to talk? Right. Understood. Last time, I didn't stand a chance against her. But today, I'm gonna win! Let's do this! so hard for this. I'll probably... No, I'll definitely win! I can see how she's moving now! Whoa, he's moving totally differently from before. I can't believe he's able to hold his own against Kunhao. I'll put this right here. Incredible. I can't believe he beat Kano. Great work! Thank you so much. Oh. Sanitsu Inosuke! Uh-oh. Mundro's getting too far ahead of me. The technique Tanjiro mastered is called Total Concentration Constant. What? By maintaining total concentration breathing every minute of the day, your physical fitness drastically improves. It's honestly quite elementary. Anyone could do it. You just need to put in the effort. Tell me, are you just not strong enough? <laughs> I was sure it would be child's play for you, Inosuke. Was I wrong about that? I guess it was just too much. Oh well then. Don't you worry. If you can't do it, I guess that's that. Excuse me? Of course I can do it! Don't you talk down to me! Huh? Please give it to your all, Zenitsu. I'm your number one supporter. <laughs> okay! Nine days later, Zenitsu and Inosuke threw themselves into their training and seem to get the hang of it in no time. Once they master total concentration constant, they finish their full body and reflex training without much trouble. Now, all three of us have finished our rehabilitation training. It was a long road, but we came out much stronger by the end of it. And now... Excellent. Looks like you're good as new. That ends the exam. Since you're in physically good health, you're fit to carry out your missions now. So I'm done training? Yes. Next is in-field combat. Great! Oh, before I forget, there's something I wanted to ask you. What is it? Have you ever heard of the Hinokami Kagura? I have not. Huh? I, I uh... Well then, what about fire breathing? Never heard of it. <laughs> well, these are techniques that I learned in my family growing up. Oh, huh. I see. So you're saying your father seemed to be using fire breathing. I've heard of flame breathing, but that's not the same thing. Huh? It's not? I don't quite know the details myself. 
I'm sorry, but I do know that they're very strict about the exact phrasing. Flame breathing must never be referred to as fire breathing. You may want to ask the Flame Hashira, Rengoku, for more details. This crow can help you out. Thank you. I'll ask him a lot of questions. For now, I'll be off. Tanjiro? Yes? You'll do great things. Thanks! All right, let's go. What's this? What's this? Huh? Is that... Is that... For the Mugen train mission, I have decided to send Tanjiro and the others. Tanjiro has a pure soul and will work diligently toward all his goals. And the potential he showed exceeded my expectations. And perhaps most importantly of all, his sense of purpose lies in defeating Kibutsuji. 
I am in complete agreement with you on those counts. On another matter, Tanjiro told me his father had used fire breathing. Ah. <sighs> As of now, there's no denying that he still has quite a ways to go. But I think that Rengoku, our flame Hashira, could give him assistance. Agreed. Considering that his sister is a demon who refrains from killing humans, and that he already came face to face with Kibutsuji, Tanjiro may very well have been born to fulfill this destiny. Hey! Wait a damn minute! What the hell is this creature?! Wait, could it be? I've heard of such a being! The master and ruler of this land! It's a steam train. You've never seen one? This might be the guardian spirit of this land. Uh, I said it's a train. You've never seen one either? A vehicle for transportation? Uh-huh. A train? So this is what the crow was talking about? The Mugen train. Hopefully I can speak to Rengoku. So what are we gonna do, Tanjiro? Let's find Rengoku. Where? I'm not picking up his scent, so he's probably on the train already. <laughs> the hell? You guys really climbing in the belly of the beast? I told you, it's a train. Yeah. Okay, I mean. You'll never expect an attack from the inside. Let's do this. Whatever. All right, let's go. Okay. Hmm. Excuse me. Uh. Hmm. Huh? Hmm? Many thanks. So this is what a train is like. Are there foot pedals somewhere? That would take a lot of people though. Listen up! Huh? Huh? I've never fought a monster this big before! Come on, guys! Let's go on a rampage inside its belly! Uh, no thanks. We'd be arrested before we even began. Hey! Huh?
okay. Okay. <laughs> this thing's fast! This Rengoku guy. He's a Hashira, right? You sure you'll recognize him? Yeah. Along with his fiery hair, I remember his scent, too. I think we're getting pretty close, so... Tasty! Huh? Tasty! 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 That's the flame, Hashira? Uh-huh. Tasty! Tasty! Excuse me, sir. Um... R Rengoku? Tasty! Um, yeah, we heard you. Ah! I see! But I don't know a thing! I've never even heard of Hinokami Kagura. Adapting your father's dance to battle is commendable. That's all I have to say about it. H hang on, are you sure you can't think of... You should become my Tsuguko, my successor. I'll take you under my wing. Not so fast, and what are you even looking at? Flame breathing has a long history. Across the ages, flame and water swordsmen have been among the Hashira. Flame, water, wind, stone, and thunder. The breathing fundamentals. All other techniques branched off from those five. For example, mist is a branch of wind. Mizuguchi, huh? what color is your sword? The name's Kamado, and my sword is black. Is it now? How unfortunate. Why do you say that? I've yet to see one with a black sword become a Hashira. Also, I hear they have no idea what style to master. But there's no need to worry. I can train you. What a considerate guy. After all that, I didn't learn a single thing about Hinokami Kagura. And he really drove home how unusual my black sword is. Haganeska and Earl Kodaki weren't expecting it either. <laughs> Don't let it get to you. There hasn't been such a Hashira yet. But who knows? You could be the first. Same with Hinokami Kagura. We simply haven't seen it yet. If you sit here stewing on it, you won't be able to concentrate on your mission. Who knows when a huh? demon might appear? Better to stay focused. Wait, there are demons on this train? Indeed. Seriously? No! I thought the train was taking us to the demons, not trapping us in here with them! I can't do this! I'm out! Over 40 people have gone missing from this train in a short period of time. We sent in several swordsmen, but they all vanished. That's why I'm here! What?! Yeah, okay, sure! I'm out! Get me off this train! Oh, I'm getting off! I need to get off! I don't want to die here! May I see your tickets, please? What's this about? The conductor needs to check that your ticket is valid. What is that? I'm picking up a horrible scent. Thank you. Very much. Hmm? Conductor, get yourself to safety. I'm afraid this is an emergency, so please overlook the sword. <laughs> what a giant! Did you use a blood demon art? It was difficult to detect you. Know this. If you bear your fangs at the innocent, We'll see your bone turn to ash 
with my bright red flame blade! Flame breathing. First ball. Unknowing fire! You're so cool! That was incredible swordplay! Please make me your apprentice! Very well then! I'll make you a fine swordsman! Me too! Me too! Me too! Me too! I'll take you all in! You're awesome, big bro! Big bro! To die while in the rapture of a dream, a blessing indeed. It doesn't matter how powerful a demon hunter you are, the spark that drives these <laughs> hmm. Why am I here? That's right. I remember now. I have to report to my father about becoming a Hashira. So what if you become a Hashira? Worthless! It means nothing. You'll still never amount to anything. Neither you, nor I. Uh, brother? Did your news make father happy? Do you think that when I become a Hashira someday, he might acknowledge me? Father wasn't always like this. In fact, he was once a Hashira himself. He was full of passion. And then one day, he quit being a swordsman. Just like that. The man who raised us both with such enthusiasm. Why? There's no use in dwelling on this now. Senjuro has been through even worse. Our mother died when he was too young to even remember her. And the anguish fathers him. To be honest, he wasn't happy. He said it meant nothing. Even so, my passion cannot be extinguished. The flame in my heart will never die out. I'll never lose faith. Listen, Senjuro. Keep this firmly in mind. You have an older brother. A brother who believes in you. Whatever path you take, you're going to become a fine man. Just keep that burning passion inside your heart. Let's show the world what we've got. We've got to keep on living. No matter how lonely it gets. I found it. Even though I can see further, I can't move beyond this. Everyone has a subconscious realm outside their dreams. In that realm, there is a spiritual core. If that core is destroyed, the dreamer becomes an empty shell. I need to hurry and destroy his spiritual core so I can have a happy dream too!
I can't breathe. I thought people couldn't move while under the spell. Is his survival instinct just that strong? Welcome back, Tanjiro! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. started crying. It really surprised me. He's so weird. <laughs> My. Perhaps you're tired today, Tanjiro. Don't push yourself too hard. Please, take the day off and rest. You're overreacting. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah. I think I just had a really bad dream. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Let's play! <laughs> Where's Nezuko? She went up the mountain to go pick vegetables. Huh? In broad daylight? Is... is that bad? Uh... well, I... guess not. You're so weird. Tanjiro, could you help me out? Go get the bath ready while I prepare for our next meal. Sure. I'll get right on it. I'm coming too! Huh? If you're going, I'm going! I gotta make sure you don't make a mess of it. Oh, come on! Now then... <sighs> huh? It's gone. What was that? I must be tired. What's wrong, Tanjiro? Oh, it's nothing. Let's go grab some water from the river. Okay! Tanjiro! This is fun! Huh? What are you doing, Tanjiro? Okay. Okay. Hurry up, Tanjiro. What's taking you so long? Okay. Here we are. Uh. 
I'll go get the water. Okay. <sighs> Wake up! Wake up! Huh? If the demon who's showing me this dream is nearby, I have to hurry and defeat them! Tanjiro! Where are you going? I picked lots of vegetables from the mountain. Oh, Tanjiro! What are you doing here? Weren't you getting water? What's the matter, dear? And why are you dressed like that? I wish... I wish I could stay here forever. I want to turn around, go back, like how it should have been, from the very beginning. If things hadn't gone wrong, you'd all be alive. Nezuko would be standing in the sunlight, under the clear blue sky. That's how it was. How it should be. But it's too late now. I can never go back! I need to hurry and break his spiritual core. How is it this beautiful? It's like it stretches on forever and feels so warm. <sighs> I 
I don't see the demon, but I can smell them. Just barely. What's happening, though? It's like there's a film over everything. A faint to It's all right. I'm alive. And the smell. That's it. The tickets. <laughs> it's subtle, but I can tell it's the same one. So we were put to sleep when these were punched. A demon must be behind it. What a faint scent for such a powerful blood demon art. <laughs> Rengoku! Sanitsu! Hinosuke! They're tied to the others with rope. Who are these people? For some reason... I have a feeling I shouldn't sever this rope with my Nichirin sword. Nezuko, listen! Can you burn the other ropes? Uh -huh. Hmm? Was the dream interrupted? Did they... Fail their mission? No matter. They're nothing but pawns anyway. They're buying me time, and that's good enough. You're all interfering! Is this girl under the control of a demon? Now that you people are here, we won't get any happy dreams! <laughs> what are you doing? Get off your ass and help us out! I don't care if you have tuberculosis. If you don't do your job, I'll go tell him. And then he won't give you any more dreams! Was he connected to my dream? She said he has tuberculosis. How awful. What a cruel demon. Taking advantage of them like this. To think I was willing to inflict pain on others. If it meant I could escape my own illness. But inside his dream, inside his soul, it was so warm. I'm sorry. I have no choice but to fight back. Good morning. What a shame. You could have stayed asleep forever. So it's him! Did I not give you a dream tailored to your every desire? 
If I had so wished it, it could have been one where your family was being slaughtered. Would you prefer a dream where your dear father comes back to life? Intruding on one soul is something I won't allow! You won't get away with this! <clears throat> What's this? Those earrings he's wearing. What good fortune. Like a moth to the flame, he came right to me. Could this be a dream? Now I can receive an even greater share of Lord Luzon's blood. Let's try the pull disc! Waterfall face it! Water wheel! Oh dear. We clean. Stay focused. No! Stare! Come at me! I'm coming after you! Waterfall face it! Water wheel! Isn't he being affected? Wait, he is. He's falling under the spell over and over. Here. Water wheel! Waterfall station! Water wheel! Waterfall! <laughs> that was not. It's time to say goodnight. <laughs> We're Water wheel! Farewell. 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 Let's Farewell. try that again. Hold it. Yeah. Yeah. Water wheel. Sleep. Why were you the sole survivor? You couldn't even save your own family. But each time he does, he remains self-aware and takes his own life in order to reawaken. This rascal is out of his mind! That was not this. No way! Let's try the water wheel! Water wheel! I'm coming after you! Hold it! Waterfall Basin! Nothing! Sleep! You're the one who should have died that day. But instead, you've gone and left us Don't all Don't put words in the mouths of my family! They would never say that! <laughs> Waterfall Basin! Oh, dear. That's my family! Don't you ever... Insult their memory! That was too easy. Could this be a dream too? I'm starting to understand why the Master called for your death alongside the Hashiras. Yes, it's quite clear now. It's the...
Please wake up, I'm begging you! Nezuko! I'm trusting you to look after the other passengers! <laughs> Explosive awakening! Now get ready for a bull rush! Watch out, cause the great lord Inosuke is coming through! Inosuke! This train isn't safe! We need to protect the sleeping passengers! The whole train is turned into a demon! Do you hear me? It's a giant demon! What do you know? I was right all along. That's the killer instinct of a true leader. I'm gonna save every last one of them. Bow down to me. Your savior, the great Inosuke, is here. No matter how many I kill, more of them keep popping up. What was that? A demon attack? Young Komodo! Ren Goku! I was... Shake earlier? His tactical mind is just as quick, too. Handling five cars? Uh, this is no time to get distracted. I have to get a move on. The demon scent is getting stronger by the moment. Let's go! What the hell's going on here? This is pretty suspicious. <laughs> Damn it! Long slumber. <laughs> You hunt the meat! I'll slice you up! So, you've discovered my neck bone. Not bad for a pair of humans, but you won't be laying a scratch on it. Instead, you'll be dying in your nightmares. <laughs> we need to hurry, Nosuke. If we take any more time here, there will be more casualties. I know already! Get moving, Kangaro! <laughs> Let's try that again. Let's try I'm coming after you. You can do this, Tucker. Try to go for the 
alone! But the meat's getting in my way! If you keep slashing, there'll be an opening! That's when we can strike! The bone's hiding under that flesh! I knew that already! Way before you said it! Oh, good job then! It's fine! I can still move my legs! I have to be careful of my surroundings and avoid being put to sleep. Come, show me your despair! This won't be easy, but I know I can do it! He knows Giz here with me! Weakling! Get ready to be torn to shreds by the great in those days! You're so nice. Just go to sleep already. Try this. Weakling. Hold it! It's wonderful, Jason! You can feel the power! I'm coming after you! Just Next time, come cross! You can't that was nothing! Hold it! Let me out! Come on! Come on! What a wheel! I'm tired of you two. Zenitsu, Nezuko, and Rengoku are counting on us! We're still fighting. Holding out until we sever its neck! Hang in there just a little longer. We'll definitely cut it! I'm coming after you! Hold it! Go Next time, come boss! I'm coming after you! No way! Let's try that again! Hold it! Next time, you can feel the power! Okay, now's our chance! Inosuke! The demon's neck is under here! Father, please guide my blade! My chance to sever the bone is now! Kami Kagura! Clear blue sky! Damn it! It's tipping over! Okay? Sandro! Are you alright? Inosuke? That damn demon had some pretty cushy meat! Lucky for us! I don't think I can move now. Can you go help the others? For me? Fine! But only cause you asked! You are my minion! It's the least I can do as a leader! <sighs> It's almost dawn. I've got to get my breathing under control. I have to help the injured. Nezuko. Zenitsu. Rengoku. I'm sure the three of them are safe. I just have to believe. My body's breaking down. I can't regenerate. Have I lost? Am I going to die? Me? Ridiculous. 
Absurd. There was so much more to do. I couldn't devour a single human. My plan to fuse with the train and eat everyone is a complete failure. And now, look what I've been reduced to after all the preparations I had taken. It was him. This is all his fault. Even with all the human hostages I had in my possession, I still wasn't able to get the upper hand. Is this the power of a Hashira? Have I truly lost? Is this the end? Ah, what a terrible, wretched nightmare this is! Am I no different from the lesser demons who get themselves killed? The upper ranks of our kind have stayed the same for hundreds of years. Even Hashira with high body counts have fallen by their hands. It's not fair! If only I could turn back time! Then I could undo this awful, horrible nightmare. You've mastered total concentration constant. That's quite impressive. Rengoku. You're one step closer to being a Hashira. That's one step out of 10,000, mind you. I'll do my best. Mastering your breathing will open many doors for you. Now it won't solve everything, but it will help. You will continue to grow stronger. Thank you. As for the others... There are many who are injured, but they're safe for the time being. Good work. Thank you. So don't strain yourself and... Why would you go after a wounded person over me? I thought he'd get in the way of our little chit-chat. What is it you would like to discuss? While this is our first time meeting, I already dislike you. Is that right? Well, I dislike weak human beings. The mere sight of them makes my skin crawl. If that's the case, I don't believe we will ever get along. Be that as it may, let me make you an offer. Why don't you become a demon as well? Never. Now, hit me! Kill! Let's try to go. Is that all? 
He regenerates quickly. In all my years, I've never gotten to kill a flame, Hashira. No one's taking me up on my offer either. Why do you think that is? As a fellow master of the martial arts, I just can't comprehend it. It's an honor to even be chosen. Not bad. What's wrong? Is that all? I will kill him. Good. 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 But it's time to finish this. Blazing universe! Rising scorching sun! Taking sword skills! Time will steal it all, Kyojiro! Doesn't that make you sad? That's just how it is! It's part of what it means to be human! A shame it has to end. But it's time to finish this. Destructive death! <laughs> Now, hit her up! Watching the hideous decline of someone blessed with such talent! Yes, more than you know! Die for me, Kyojiro! Do it while you're young and strong! Kill yes. Blazing universe! Blazing universe! <laughs> Blazing universe! Oh, come on. Come on, destructive death! Incredible! Just amazing! Don't die on me yet, Kyoji. Don't you see that you are... Those impressive attacks you inflicted upon me have already healed completely. You, on the other hand, a smashed left eye, shattered ribs, damage to the internal organs, all irreparable. If you were a demon, you'd heal in the blink of an eye. Those wounds would be but mere scratches. In the end, a human can never surpass a demon. I will see my duty fulfilled! No matter what it takes, no one shall die here! What an impressive fighting spirit! To press on, despite your bodily injuries! That takes brilliant strength of mind! Now you have to become a demon! Just imagine it! We can fight for the rest of eternity! Kill him! Fifth 
My, what an indomitable force of will! I give you my praise! Ninth form, Rang Doku! Technique development, destructive death! Kyojiro. to have been your son! He stopped it? What unbelievable strength! Even after I've skewered his body with my arm! Oh, oh, damn it! The sun will rise soon! I have to kill him and make my escape! Oh, oh, why can't I pull my arm out? I won't let you escape! I have to slice that demon's head off! And fast! The sun is rising. I have to get away. Let go of me! Let go of me! I'm not letting go! Not until I cut off your head! Let go! He knows gay listen to me! If we don't help him now, it'll be too late! Beast breathing! I've got to find shelter from the sunlight!
Don't work yourself up like that. Those wounds are not trivial. Your death, young Commodore, would truly spell my defeat. Come here, lad. Let us speak one last time. Very soon, I'll be dead. Before that happens, I need you to hear me out. I have a younger brother named Senjuro. Mother, was I successful in my duties? Did I use my gifts wisely? You did splendidly. Figure out how to get there! Everything that dies returns to the Earth! Crying won't bring any of them back! Remember what Bug Eye said to you! No matter how pathetic you feel, you just gotta keep on living! 
But you're crying too. I can see the tears coming out of your mask. I'm not crying! Come on! Let's go train our asses off! Not even a single one of those 200 passengers lost their lives? Splendid job indeed. He was a remarkable young man. I feel no sadness. My life will soon reach its end as well. I'll see Kyojiro and the others again in the world beyond. Commodore. Young, Young Commodore. Commodore. Where am I? Nezuko! Zenitsu! No one's here. I'm not picking up any of their scents. Am I still stuck in that demon's dream? But... I haven't lost any memories this time. What is this? I'm not sensing any malicious intent. It's like someone's calling out to me. I wonder what's beyond this door. <sighs> what the? This is Demon Slayer HQ. I was just in the hospital. Huh? The door's gone. And my clothes. What's going on? Crazy things are happening. But I don't feel scared at all. In fact... <sighs> Rengoku! Rengoku! Why? Incredible. What a powerful fighting stance. Just from this, I can already tell how formidable he is. I see. He's telling me to come at him with everything I have. I accept your challenge! Give my own. I can't hold anything back. That's what Ren Goku wants from me. If I went easy on him, it would be an insult. I'm still not sure what's going on, but I'll worry about that later. <laughs> Let's try that again. I'm coming up. <laughs> what are we? Up? <laughs> no way. That was nothing. Hold it. He's not leaving any openings. He's unbelievably strong. His movements are different from water breathing. They still flow so gracefully. This is the strength of flame breathing. This is the power of a Hashira. Let's try that. I'm coming after. Water wheel. Blazing universe. I was not told it! <laughs> uh, no! I'm coming after-
after you! Fourth form! Striking time! Let's try to pull this! Water wheel! I'll use every ounce of my strength! After clashing blades over and over, I finally understand. I'm seeing him one last time for a reason! Every time my blades clash, I can hear his voice! And Goku's words, his wisdom, face forward, grit your teeth, set your heart ablaze. From here on, leave it to me. Snare, come at this. There's nothing you can do! I'm coming after you! Waterfall Basin! Whirlpool! <laughs> Hold it! <laughs> Water wheel! <laughs> I'm coming! Rising <laughs> 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 Scorching Sun! <laughs> Water wheel! <laughs> Stay focused! <laughs> I'm coming after you! Waterfall Basin! Waterfall Basin! Hold it! Waterfall Basin! There! Come at me! Let's try that again! I'm coming! Water Wheel! Whirlpool! Hold it! No way! That was nothing! I'm coming up! Let's try it. Hold it! <laughs> Waterfall Basin! Water Wheel! Whirlpool! <laughs> I'm coming after you! Flame breathing! Esoteric art! Ninth form! Inokami Kagura! Everything I could. Everything. And yet all I could do was knock his sword away. <sighs> Rengoku is ridiculously strong. <sighs> Thank you, sir. This is...
A dream. It was just... a dream. All of it? Nezuko. I've... lost a lot of people I cared about. My family. Fellow demon slayers. The demons have taken so much away. But... I still have people who matter to me. I still have bonds I want to protect. That's why I'll continue wielding my sword. For as long as I have those bonds, as long as the torches I carry keep lighting my way to prevent anyone else from suffering this sadness, I'll grit my teeth, face forward, and set my heart ablaze. Let's go! No matter what happens, I'll keep pressing on. Illuminated by firelight, a spiritual dance begins. Within the blaze burns a courage tempered by battle. In this conflagration, bonds between warriors are forged. They crystallize together into the pillars of today. Pillars with the strength to slay demons. And so... This is how the torch is passed. Kindling the spirits of those who came before. As warriors hone their battle-worn blades. They learn what it means to be... A demon slayer.